Ashley, this is your favorite game of all time. You could say that, yeah. <laughs> uh, I have no familiarity with any of these games. The I didn't even know there was an HD version of this game coming out until literally you stormed in here and was like, we should play that. And I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> is it a, a we play kind of game or like a you play kind of game? And you're like, it's kind of both. And I'm uh, so... We're going to find out to see if they changed anything from the original. Uh, it is a remaster, mm -hmm. not a remake. So I don't think they changed a whole lot, but... Hopefully there's a little more involvement for two-player stuff, some quality of life stuff, etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, let's get started and we can see. Yeah, we wanted to start from the... I don't know what it's called on the PS5. The it's landing PS5 The landing page. page. I don't know what... I, I've, the cross-media bar is what it was called on the PS3. I think they've changed the names. Anyway, uh. we wanted to start from there because I think there is a... In, is this a Square game? It is a square game. In the square usually starts with a video before the main menu, and we didn't want to miss it. Right. So, so let's go ahead and see how that goes. Three, two, one. Square Enix now. Very important. I don't know who M2 is. I don't know who M2 is either. I've never heard of them. I don't know if they're just the of mana people or right. What. Yeah, it's been it's been a while. Um, this is all this is all totally new that they redid. So this game has like you were saying you were saying this game now has like anime stuff in it that it definitely like um, this. Was I think definitely this not <laughs> is the only anime thing that they did, which okay. I did watch it uh, because it did get released previously not mm -hmm. too long ago it's so cute like why isn't there an anime with all of these characters it would be great and i would watch every single minute of it um it, originally it was just kind of like all of the art the still art flying around with this music mm -hmm. um and kind of showing you what the world looked like and what you're gonna do but this is much more dynamic and very cute <laughs> but Will these be... I wish I knew anything about this These series. are all characters that you what? come across in the game. Do you think these will be cutscenes that we see in the game I now? don't... You I don't, don't think so? No, I don't think so, but they were so, like, mum on all the details for the most part. I have no idea. I was pretty surprised when you told me this remaster was only $30, because that's just so right. rare. Right, um... Which makes me think that maybe they didn't change that much. Right. Um, I do know that they repainted all the backgrounds. Mm -hmm. um, I think you still maintain the pixely goodness of all of your characters and um, items and stuff. So I don't think they really upped the resolution on any of that, which I'm fine with. Yeah. But uh, new backgrounds is fun. I really like this. It's really cool looking. Kind of gets you in the mood to go on an adventure. A little bit more than the original, I think, did. Are those the two... You said there's like a boy and a girl. Yeah. Do, is it like uh, Genshin style where the other one becomes a character if you don't pick them? Or do they simply cease to exist? No. Yeah, you don't ever reference the other If you like, pick the girl, there is no boy. Right, yeah, which I don't think that's changed. Um, mm -hmm. I have no idea. We're going to find out. but. And we don't think that it's voiced right i don't think so there there were no voices in the original obviously it came out in 1999 um i do know the font changed i can tell you that right now mm -hmm. oh boy oh it is so many translations that it defaults to japanese i love it i think that's great <laughs> uh, don't button through that too fast or you will be playing in japanese right that's really cool there was no back then language that options. That art is really nice. Yes, the art is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's it's so painterly and like watercolors. Um, obviously you can see little pixel sprites down there. Those are original. Mm -hmm. They look super cute still. Um, but yeah, everything about like art and the backgrounds and stuff is phenomenal. And the music, don't even get me started. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and not pick a knife. <laughs> Okay, so is this like your, do you ever get to change this? Or yes. is that just how you're going to fight forever? So you start with a weapon. Okay. Um, 
Oh god, I'm not picking a bow either. I was never good at the bow in this game, but maybe I'll try it out. Do I get to make a guy, or do I- I'm gonna get a guy? So... You will possibly be playing other characters in the world. Okay. If that makes sense. Um, there are quite a few little adventures that you go on with a couple of NPCs who recur. And that was where they were trying to sell the two-player mode back then. It was really weird, right. though, because you had to have, like, two controllers, two memory cards, all of that stuff. You had to go in and out in a very tedious way, so okay. we'll see. But I'm going to pick the one-handed sword for now. Okay. Um, it's basic, but it will get you through pretty much all the stats. Displays the virtual keyboard, chooses a name at random. That auto is does is not random, but okay. <laughs> that's a really weird way to say random. I think that's what it was in the original too, was just auto would give you but a funny no, name. There is no canonical name for the protagonist that you No, have. you it's you. You get to pick your character's okay. name. You can put little symbols and stupid stuff in it too. Okay. Uh, let me see if it's in here. You can give him a yen symbol if you want. Yeah, you used to be able to like put a little heart or a star, and I would do that sometimes in my playthroughs. I think it was really dumb. I don't think the PS5 has symbols on the keyboard, and that's going to be what it uses. Also, it put, it it did a little. I don't think unless you're plumage now. I am. It says a. Er, no. If you press done, okay. Yeah, no, that's okay. fine. Okay, okay, um, okay. We're good. Yeah, I can see these keyboards not having that mm -hmm. stuff because it wasn't. Because the PS1 didn't have a keyboard, per right. se, it was just in-game. Right, right, right. I don't want to auto... Okay, finalizes. That's so yes. funny that they're giving you all of these, like, explainers, because they never did. <laughs> it was just very, like, you had to find your way around. Um, so here's the big-ass map that you get to pick from. Right. Which... Okay. <laughs> darkened areas cannot be chosen which always perplexed me as a kid. Does this matter? Yes. What? This absolutely matters. Um, what? This, I, I'm telling you from like the very beginning, this totally matters. You're glancing at a guy just to make sure we don't totally screw ourselves here. I just to make sure we pick exactly a, a decent starting zone. To be. This affects all of like your elements and stuff. And when you place your artifacts to make new lands okay yeah so you see all the little guys down there those are elements um and everything where you place stuff affects those levels and okay you want them to be optimum for other things that you're going to be able to do I, i'm getting <laughs> heavy disgaea energy from all of this possibly yeah um again this one is much different from their other entries yeah no kidding what does the mailbox do? The mailbox is home. Why is the mailbox home? Because that's where your mailbox is, Who isn't it? Who are all At of home? our dancing friends in the corner? Those are the elements. Are they me? No. Are they going to be? No? <laughs> no. Those are the elements? Yeah, those are the elements. Look how cute they are. What element is one big bat guy, one large bat wing, one small bat wing guy? Which one? Batwing? Bat that's sperm Shade over there. That's that's Shade. That's He's so sh cute. Is Shade an is Shade an element? Yeah. Is, uh, is I think mayonnaise that's... an element? No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, probably, actually, somewhere. What element is guy with weird hat that's dancing? Weird hat? Uh, that's gnome. Gnome. Oh wait, there's another guy with weird hat that's dancing. That... Is gnome an element? Yes, he is. He's Earth. <laughs> Um, so that's Wisp, Shade, Where am I? <laughs> Dryad, Aura, Salamander up there uh -huh. uh, in the corner. That's the day. So the element changes every day. Uh huh. Um, Salamander, Gnome. I stopped listening for three seconds and I just, I played it back in my head what you just said of each day is a different element. What does that mean? I, you'll see. Okay. You'll see. Why don't we place the mailbox? Um... Again, we're I, referencing just to make I sure. I am, because I want the optimum placement. And you've played this game like four times before, and you still need a, a refresher on where to place I've things. I've played this game actually way more than four times, but this is just the guide I like to follow to get through the initial playthrough, because it unlocks everything. Could could you could you just screw yourself here? and like Yes. Okay. 
Is yes. it like, will you make an unfinishable game? No, there's no way that you can unfinish it. Okay. Oh, another beautiful, fun cutscene. I think this is original. This seems right. Um, you can always get to the end. There will be events that you cannot unlock if you don't have the optimum placement. Okay. There are many combinations of optimum placement, though. This one is just the best one I've ever found that I really like. Okay. People have been working on this game for years, literally, to unlock it. I mean, we, when I tell you, variables you do, well, does it always start with this? When you put your house down, yes. Okay. I believe this, this is, is not unique. I to think where... they cleaned it up a little bit. It definitely looks. This is not unique to our biome. If I can. No, 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 no. Okay. I think they cleaned it, though. That that light effect was definitely not on PS1. <laughs> Okay. But, and neither so, was this effect. This was not a SNES game, this was a PS1 game? This was a PS1 game. Um, okay. I think the original Seeker of Mana was on SNES. Um, and is actually, Seeker of Mana like this? Secret of Mana. Secret of Mana, sorry. Seeker of um, Mana no, is my own favorite no, game. No, because it on. was, um, this is actually totally different. I'm just kind of realizing right now. Okay. Wow, it looks really cool. Um, looks a lot better. Similar but different. Sorry, I'm getting caught up in like the art and how much they smoothed it out. Um, well, we, you know, okay, okay. Well, that's so neat looking. Bosses. Goodbye, bosses. Uh, artifacts. Okay, is that not? Are they dungeons? You'll place them in the map, and they'll make places that you can go to to travel to for events. That is very disguised. Okay, this is exactly what it looks like, except they totally redid the mailbox to be 3D. Okay. This is so good. Okay. Look how 3D it is. It's right. great. Yeah, no. I... It used to be very, like, 3D pixely, though, you know, where it's, like, 3 FPS does, cutscene. Does this game have, a, like, a story? And I don't mean that in, like, a dismissive way, but does it have a story, or are we just trying to save so, something? The thing that makes this entry so funny mm -hmm. and different from the rest is, yes, because the original like secret of mana and the other games that came before this um i think this one's number three there are two games that technically chronologically come before it okay those games have a set storyline much like final fantasy this one you're kind of just going around the world and helping everybody okay yep uh there are a ton of storylines though that kind of lead back to the big story sort of there but are characters though there's right so many characters okay yeah can they die uh not in the way that like you they think. can't die die <laughs> like i can't get a guy killed and then no we can't that's way too mature okay like, all right this game was rated t back in the day um but Nine cent okay, I that. need this. Nine centuries ago, the mana tree burned to ashes. The power of mana, or mana, lived on inside the mana stones. <laughs> Enchanted instruments or artifacts. Sages fought amongst themselves to gain control of these last remnants of mana. There okay. was a big war, basically. And there's a bunch of weird random lore about this. Okay. Uh, that you can find in the game. Then, but... after hundreds of years of war, as the power of mana began to wane, those who sought it grew scarce and peace returned to the world. Is this new story or story of the first two games? Um, You're I allowed to say I don't know. Yeah, I don't remember how <laughs> okay. much of this is encompassed by the original games, only because this was the first one that I ever played. Okay. And I only ever played a little bit of like Secret of Mana. Mm-hmm. But because I liked this one so much because it was me, I'm the protagonist. I'm, you know, I'm not an already named character. Yeah. Like, I kind of just ended up playing this a shit ton more times. <laughs> and again, there's like lore that you find in weird places in like encyclopedia kind of style. Okay. So you end up reading a lot of weird stuff that I think really pertains to this world mostly right okay. i don't think this world is necessarily in the same timeline as the other worlds henceforth mankind grew afraid to desire their hearts filled with empty emotions and grew estranged from my from my hands okay so we're you are nine. the monetary okay i'm the manatory yes Do I, she okay. is talking in the background here they turned their gaze away from my infinite power and troubled themselves with petty disputes 
All this wording seems pretty similar. I think they okay. cleaned it up a little bit. Yeah. Also, the font being this big is like amazing. It was so tiny uh -huh. back then and pixely. So hard to read. Remember me. Need me. I can provide you with everything. I am love. Find me and walk beside me. That was basically just a Bible verse. I, I was going to say, it is vaguely religious <laughs> now that I'm older and I understand uh -huh. that, but I think it's more like leaning toward the power of nature, too. Sure. Instead of just straight up religion. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Okay. We are waking up from a nap. Ow. Would you have preferred, I'm going to ask you this right now, because I, I, I don't, I think I would have, the sprite art up against the new art looks strange um by the way that was important because you could only save at statues and now you can basically save everywhere okay so that's cool that's a change okay um i have always okay yeah you can still use the d-pad Woo! that's how i used to play <laughs> um I've always really, really liked the sprite art, but mm -hmm. now that everything is in very high resolution, right? Would I think have... it does look kind of silly. And also, I remember um, when they released this game for PS3 and then again on PS4, you, or you could play them back and forth or whatever. It started to look strange there too, only because right. our TVs started to get better, but the games like this did not. Um, so, I don't know. That that's a cactus with a face that you're talking to. That is a cactus. Talk to with him. Face. If you if I had the option to talk to him, I would. He has nothing to say. Okay. Not right now. All right. I guess we're gonna leave him there. Everything is pretty um, self-explanatory. A... You have cactuses that are not alive, though. In the other corner, you have that's, a cactus that's not alive. That's his diary. Okay. That's a okay. Yeah. There is where. Yeah, there, you have cactuses over oh, there. Those guys. Yeah. There. You can't talk to them. I don't no. think. No. All right. I can't. We're gonna go downstairs. Okay. God, she looks like she's running so fast. I feel like... When do I walk? I don't... Can I walk? Oh my I god, am I just running all the time? I think so. Oh boy. Okay. You can, like, walk in this game, but I guess not. Also, you should check your house, because, like, you might get a little present like that. Is lucre the... the That's your current... currency. Okay. It's, uh, That's gold. our gill. Yeah. Pretty much. Okay. Uh, this is your library. Um... There's really nothing here yet. You'll be able to check everything here. Eventually, it will fill itself in as you. Uh... Uh -huh. Oh, that's an arm. I was that's like, an arm. It's that? a little backhand. Okay. Um, yeah, that clock looks like Among Us. <laughs> um, when I was little, I always wanted to just interact with everything, and you really can't. I think well, which is kind of disappointing. With the pixel art up against the backgrounds, it will be plainly obvious what you can and can't interact true. with now true 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 um this is our house it's really cute okay um you can check this out over here uh this is gonna be a forge eventually there's nothing in here yet cool all right later i like the forge jam yeah even though we got a couple seconds of it a little tease of the forge jam we'll be back there uh, okay. Monster Crawl, you can catch monsters in the wild, and uh -huh. they'll become your best friends. Uh, sure. You gotta feed them, and give them a pat, and then also um, take them out, and they can help you fight. This game ends, right? Like, that you can beat it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, when you decide to is up to you, though. And it's even on the shorter side for a JRPG. Like, it's, you know, 25 kinda, hours or yeah, so. Yeah, if you breeze through it at, like, you kind of don't know what you're doing okay. or you just whatever. Yeah, 20 to 25 hours. Mm -hmm. Hey, let me talk to you. This is Spratling. The world can be shaped by your imagination. Okay. Ooh, I'm so happy to know that. Thanks, Spratling. No. Did I, I know that? I didn't. You do get the choice. I uh, knew that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't know that. Pokeo? Uh, Pokeel? Poke. Okay. <laughs> That's how I was. The poet it. told me that the town of Domina exists because I think it does. Oh god, we're getting so philosophical right in the beginning. Babe, of the game. what is this game? <laughs> this game rocks. Like I played this as a nine year old and the reason I had it is because I loved the art. Okay. And my mom was like, Alright. Okay. <laughs> this 
game is so weird. I love it so much. Okay. Yep. Uh, if you can't find Domino with your eyes, find it with your imagination. Okay. You get a well, rainbow. I will try. <laughs> Here, use this. Sweet. Got some color blocks. What is a color block? It's an artifact. That's the town of Domina? That is the town of Domina. You're like, all right, little grass dude. Do you place the town? We sure do. What? <laughs> so is this game, are, I guess I don't, are you familiar with Act Razor? Have you heard of Act Razor? Probably, yeah. So Act Razor's whole thing is you are basically like a guardian angel of a realm and you build the realm and then you go do like 2D side scroller levels okay. to defend it. Okay. And it, it feels like it has this level of story of just like, I assume things are going to start threatening your land and we're going to have to play a beat em up to stop it, right? Is that what kind the gameplay of, of this game is? Kind of, yeah, that, that sounds familiar and I'm not sure when that came out, but it's possible. It Act has Razor, influence. I think, is 89. Yeah, it's possible, like, that that was totally an influence, you know? Like, they wanted to do something that wasn't so, like, straightforward Final Fantasy. Um, okay, we're, town okay. is going to be right above our house. Okay. So, cool, super convenient to get to. I'm going to walk on over, which, yeah, you can just walk across it, the map. <laughs> is this going, you can say no to this, but is this going to make sense, or is this just the way the world works? This is just the way the world works. Okay. You should just roll with it. I'm rolling with it. I saw you got some points in, uh, bouncing butt plug. I oh my god, which one? You're, you're two thirds on that one now. Oh, uh, Aura, and it's Aura Day in Domino. Oh, no it's not. We're gonna change, it's Gnome Day now. Okay, we Which, have no points in Gnome. Not yet. Don't worry. I'm, It'll I'm, all be filled in soon enough. I'm not worried. It's like a weird little puzzle. Uh, oh, these indicators are very much nicer. What are all of the, are these all scenes that you could step into? So those are just telling you where on the map you need to go. Okay. Um, they don't go away as far as I remember, okay. but they used to be really badly blended in. like. Maybe I just have weird eyes, but I never used to be able to see them. Now I can, so okay. thanks. All right. Okay, um, we've got a little guy with an onion on his head yelling at this guy over here with a shield on his head. Okay. His name is El Azul, El Azul okay. which is going to be pertinent is, later. Is he a guy that, can I play as that guy? Yes. Okay. Onion Knight says, geez, he's a piece of work. He kind of is. Okay. Let's go. Can. Uh, so, wait. What are we doing? Or do we not know what we're doing yet? We don't really know what we're doing yet. Okay. Um, you can follow this dude. Uh, We've not had our call to action yet. Mm -mm. Here's the weapon shop. Everything changes every day, too, for the most part. Okay. Um, the further you go into the world, the better items you can buy. Um, I don't know if I want to buy anything yet. Hmm. What's the highest defense item we can buy? A shield. Hmm. Uh, Can't buy a spear yet. Spears does, are so awesome. Does that change the way that you fight then? If you just can, can your character use any weapon? Yeah. Even after you picked your weapon at the oh, beginning? Oh yeah, totally. You can buy every weapon. You'll be able to modify all the weapons later, too. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it all comes down to like what they're made out of and what you have on hand and things that you can like infuse into them. Let's just look. We don't have any armor right now. Okay. What are our stats? We've got fives all across the board. There's a lot of stats in this game. I um, see that. And the icons are incredibly self-explanatory. Right. Like, uh, they all have to do with the elements, too, that are, like, built into your armor and your weapons. Go to the right one. Uh, defense. Okay. See, I I would have thought It's like defense. an arrow, like, pinging off of you. <laughs> I love that the guy's just like, oh, no. Yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, wait, is this, the, is this the eight elements? 
Each one corresponds to an element? Yes. Okay, okay, so defense is gnome. Yeah. Okay, constitution, <laughs> constitution. is dryad. Yeah. Okay. I'm... Okay. Right, so this will start to change when you um, start getting weapons and instruments and armor that you have mm, either manufactured yourself or modified yourself um, okay. with different elemental coins. Uh, you get elemental coins by going out into the wild and... Oh, cool. <laughs> and basically singing a nice song to the elements that you okay. find there and they'll be like here you go here's some money we'll see sure okay that's cool so let's buy some armor we don't have any instruments yet it's not worth buying instruments quite yet um i would rather just no, make them not. you only start with literally a hundred lucre uh-huh so um let's see can you have a shield and a sword at the same time because you have a one-handed... Right, right. I think yeah. so. I never played with shields, <laughs> admittedly. Okay. Um, I think I always picked, like, two-handed sword, because... Because two-handed swords are cool. Because they are cool, it's true. Um, and that thing hits, like, a brick shit house in the beginning, but it's harder to level. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, so... Uh, so is Sorry. a shield a weapon? Or is it an armor? Okay, it's an armor. Mm -hmm. Uh, right. Oh gosh, sorry, I'm still getting no, used to fine. this. It's been a long time. Uh, equip. Here we go. Let's put that bad boy in there. Yep. Can we equip the boots? Yeah. We can. Sure. Cool. So okay. our defense against strikes is still meh. Against what slashes. Is, what is the difference between thrust. a strike, a slash, slash, and a thrust? We have zero magic defense. That sucks. Uh, Will it become some, obvious? Yeah, some enemies okay. can do, like, I think all three. Uh, some enemies just have, like, a set amount of, like, kind of moves that they do. But you'll see, like, thrust is literally what you think it is. Slash, and then bang, basically. And mm -hmm. then magic is magic, obviously. Uh, we don't have any instruments yet. Is this game, like really heavy on combat yes and no it's more grindy um the monsters are super easy okay i've never had an issue with them really like their difficulty levels this game starts you off on normal difficulty like you can't change it until you beat it once so that's nice okay am i an adventurer sometimes all right we you already know? spent our money so yeah well you know. this advice was a little late oh well I got some fancy boots. That's okay. okay. Uh, this is a teapot, and Whoa, they talk there was like a, a British scary person. bloke in ear just now. Okay. <laughs> he said, "I'm looking for me lost girlfriend. Have you seen her?" So I says, "No, I ain't, gov. Honest." But then he said I was lying and started threatening me. Maybe he was a stalker. Blimey! It's the most like stereotypical Brit. And that was in there originally Wait, as well. Who's that guy? Oh, yeah, Mark is sitting in his chair. Mark? His name's Mark. Isn't the other guy's name like Aragal or something? <laughs> Elizol? Yeah, Elizol. this guy's name is just Mark. And his daughter is Rachel. Okay. Sure. Uh, he's a stick bug or a stag beetle guy. Okay. You can kind of see that, like his horns. And his daughter is missing, I think. Okay. Yay, we get a book from him. And we can Shoko. go. Hi, do you want to come up here? <laughs> He's looking at us. Choco, the make a decision. The cat wants to know In or what out. we're doing. He might, he's early for food. Oh, no, he's making the decision. Hi. Hello. Hi. He wants to play. Up okay. or down? You can fit. Come on, kitty cat. Come play the game. He's like, I think I'm just going to sit here and be annoying. And so meow. if he continues to be annoying, I'll kick him out. But. Okay. Very gently kick him out. Yeah. Uh, we already checked out the shop. Cool. Cool. We got an encyclopedia. Come up here. Hi. <laughs> uh, I don't think we can go upstairs. Oh, we can go upstairs. Into Rachel's room. That's kind of creepy. Uh, I don't think she has anything for us. 
though. Young man, may I help you? How about we feed him? Do you want me to feed him? Sure. Shall I pause? You can pause. I will be right back. Okay, we're back. Okay. Cat is fed. The cat Let's is go. fed. <laughs> Doesn't mean he's gonna be quiet, but the cat is now fed. Yeah, I mean... I'm sure he's super wondering what we're up to. This <laughs> cool game that we're starting to play today. Yeah. Alright, so... This info that we learned here about this guy's daughter disappearing, um... Later. We'll figure it out later. Okay. Um, there's another one of these dudes in town. He's sproutling. I like that they let you know. Yeah. Um, we're actually gonna not talk to Elizol yet. Okay. Um, we are going to go up here, I believe. Uh, -da. Is it a bad move to talk to Elizol now? Yes, because it will trigger something that you don't want to yet in this particular um, walkthrough. Okay. Right. Which, as a little kid, like, my instant instinct was, oh my god, I gotta go talk to that guy. And then... And then you blew it without realizing it. And, yeah, like, it's... You're really supposed to figure it out yourself, but, like, there's no guide. Okay. There's no guidance in-game, so... Um, this, this guy, guy says, says... everyone with a soul disappears eventually. Thanks, Sproutling. Oh. Okay. okay. Sproutlings never go away, though. Good for them. They don't have souls. Ah, uh, Okiel said so. Cool. So can do that's you great. like can you eat sproutlings or like what's the um, deal? Maybe not. Okay. Let's not eat them because they're like a tree. My name's Niccolo. I'm a traveling merchant. What's up, Niccolo? <laughs> He's a big bunny. But I have a problem, and the highway is crawling with bandits. Oh, all right. It's yep. too dangerous to leave town, don't you think so? Okay, are we gonna kill these bandits? Do I think so? Do these matter? Do these weird choices that you have to constantly not, make matter? Not really. I think it just adds a little flavor to the game. Okay. Um, there's no karma system or anything. Um, I think only a couple times it matters to say stuff. I love this guy. Yeah, this guy rocks. I love like, this guy's look, his energy. He yeah. has a sombrero for some reason. He does. Yep. He's uh, colorful and bouncy and uh -huh. very good at his job. So he says that Prudent people like us should stay inside where it's safe. So we're apparently prudent people. Um, this is Mei Mei. Okay. She's a bowl of fruit. Look, her hair is grapes. Okay. Uh, she's a fortune teller. Sure. Let's. Sure. I'll give her ten. Look, her. I only have thirty, so that leaves me with twenty. Is this a? Does this do something? Not really. <laughs> um. She. It's just kind of. Fun. You do have to come back to her at some point. Okay. But this doesn't. This won't hurt anything. It says eat your vegetables. Okay. We will do that. Okay. I guess. Yep. We're gonna go ahead and uh, head out. Now, which node are we going to? Oh, I think this is the maybe same we node we were back. just. So we gotta yeah. go up, maybe. Maybe we have to talk to him again. No. Ah, I have to say no. Okay. Here we go. It would does the, matter, but like it won't kill the quest necessarily. Would the game have not started if you didn't know to say no to this guy? Yeah, if you didn't come back and say no, or try all the options. But the game doesn't really punish you in that way that you would think. It's not that modern. <laughs> okay. It's not that mean. Um, usually you can go back and try again. Okay. Let's teach those bandits Do a I lesson. Do I get to play as that guy? I think you can. <gasps> yeah, let's let's go do it. Ooh, we're a mercenary. He likes people who know the value of money. Oh, that was very cool. Oh, wow, that animation looks great now. We need to stop and see Tipo, who's the big teapot we talked to earlier. Uh, we're going to go with him. Are party members permanent? No. No? You're part of my party? Oh. oh, it didn't play the noise. There used to be a noise that would play when someone joined your party. Maybe he's just a temp party member, so we don't get the noise. Right, nobody is permanent other than when you can make pets and golems part of your party. Oh, is this game Dragon's Dogma, then? <laughs> is this game literally like Dragon's Dogma? Possibly. You'll see. Okay, so Nicolo is gonna, like, barter with this other person. Or tea, teapot? I think okay. Tipo's a girl. I'm not sure. Okay. I'm not sure. Well, um, she's very cute. I know. She's sweet. And Anya Knight is also sweet, but 
Very outspoken. Uh, Onion Knight reminds me of um, Watermelon Girl from Dr. Stone. Yeah, kind of does. Why am I forgetting her name? Are you also Suica. forgetting her Okay, nice. <laughs> I think that literally means melon in Probably. Japanese. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, so Nikola has a wheel. <laughs> okay. It looks like a regular old wheel to me, which it might or might not be. You're right. This is just an old wheel, nothing special. Goodbye. Oh, look at him. He's he threw the he threw the hook and he's gonna get line and sinker right now. Do we play as the teapot also? No. 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 Okay. But I will be able to play as Sombrero Rabbit. <laughs> I think so, yeah. <gasps> I'm so excited for that. Wow, he's really trying to fleece her for fifty thousand dollars for a wheel. I mean we don't know what the exchange rate is. Yeah. It could be five dollars, who knows. It's still a lot for an old wheel. Yeah. Don't nothing cost that much. Blimey. <laughs> Bring me fifty thousand and you can have it. Till then. I'll let Pluma use it. Yay! We got our second artifact. What is an artifact? Are they weapons? No, remember no. they're the things that you place on the world to make the other lands. Oh wait, so the wheel is just a whole land. Yep. Okay. Let's go. I wouldn't say Nicola is useless, but heartless or whatever, but he's just a good businessman. Okay, we're gonna ignore everything else here. Does the game tutorialize you on when you can play multiplayer, or do I just should I just press start at some point? Um mm, I, mm, I don't remember. The game we'll doesn't tutorialize you on a whole lot. Oh, you don't say. Yeah, like, it's... I don't even know how I managed to pick this up as a kid. Okay, we're gonna go... put the wheel, and go to the highway, and beat up some bandits. Yeah. Oh, that was weird. Okay. So, boop. But the wheel is where the bandits are? Yes. So the wheel becomes S this other place that we can enter. So... And it's gonna be right next to our house! Wait, oh boy! Wait, I have to interject. Yes. Why? I thought we were saying there were bad guys before, but they lived in this wheel. They live in the wheel. But they were... <laughs> Why couldn't you have left Domina before if there were bandits there, but you just made the world where the bandits live? Because he knew. Oh. Okay. I mean, you have to think about it as these are kind of like weird portals into these other worlds that already exist. This okay. is just your access. Should I try to, to press it? start yeah. now? Yeah, let's try. I don't think I can yet. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i just have the controller in my hands sure. and pretend. Also, Onion Knight is just here. Okay. Uh, literally the same guy. My name's uh, Chumpy. Yeah. No, that's not my name. If you said yes there, would your name become Chumpy? I think he starts calling you Chumpy. Okay. Ooh, useful nuggets to help us in battle. I like nuggets. What do you want to know? Here we go. Uh, abilities. What are abilities? Oh, there's a lot of things to learn here. Mm -hmm. Action abilities. They are useful. Use them. Select one player and skills. I'm probably going to change them. It's weird that one of the many things that you can ask the Onion Knight about isn't, like, how do you play multiplayer? Because the game... It, it the, might be under other tips. Okay. Um, and I think he does tell you this stuff in the beginning of the game. Okay. Um, D oh my push, gosh, there's so much stuff. Love and hate? Grapple. <laughs> like, the problem with this, though, is because it's just a central info dump, and you don't get anything else anywhere else. Well, I mean, you else. won't process any of this. No, exactly. So imagine being nine and being like, uh, ST, love and hate, like, not, not knowing. Like, let me get a pen and, and paper and just write this down. Literally, yes. Like, I do believe I wrote stuff down at some point, because I was just like, huh? Like, a lot of the time I just kind of buttoned through. And, like, I don't know, um, mashed, which okay. you kind of can. It's kind of a masher, like, for uh, combat. Okay. Tapping the buttons. You can press circle to perform a quick attack. 
Okay. Combos. We're hitting it lots of times, so mash those buttons, basically. Weapons, etc. If you do too many attacks, you'll freeze. Totally true. Uh, it's really not that big of a deal. Um, power attack is basically, like, kind of a, like, two-second cooldown or whatever. Okay. A little stronger. Um, do I think I'm a good fighter? Yes. Okay, cool. So you can combine those things. Um, there are secret moves, blah blah blah. So, um, you have to basically master all the special techniques to get these moves. Which is a lot of button mashing. Okay. Cool. Cool. Sure. Sure. Which buttons? They just immediately, like, it's very funny that they just immediately break the fourth wall. They, like, they don't even try to, <laughs> like, hide it in any meaningful way. Right, because this is the only time they're really going to do that. Um, with It's such an info dump with everything right here. And you can always go back and check your encyclopedia, blah, blah, blah. Uh -huh. But, oh god, okay. There, there's, see, there's menus within menus within menus right here at this very point, and I don't think any other time. So they're like, let's just describe all the mechanics. Like, Who thought that was a good idea? Right, straight up. Like, what? I, I don't know. Um, synchro is important. Basically, you have this little diamond, and mm -hmm. you sync up with your uh, other player characters, Okay. and with your pets and stuff. Uh, hit points, we know what hit points are. ST meter is your special technique meter. Uh, that's like your... What would that be called? Um, your limit break. Your limit break, yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know. Mm -hmm. But it's a special technique. Right. Yeah, so that one, those are cool. Uh, sometimes they whiff. <laughs> I'll probably whiff a little bit, just because I don't remember the timing. Any other helpful info? <laughs> Enemies are too strong, it's too difficult. How what? can I win? Try shouting your sweetheart's name before a fight, it's the only way. Okay. It sure helped when I had to move my huge piano. Okay. Right? Does this game... But you said that this game has one difficulty, so if you can't do it, you just, you're stuck, right? It doesn't have... Well, it has just this normal Normal, normal is easy. Until, normal is... Yeah, until you get to New Game Plus, then you can choose much harder ones. Okay. Um, combos are great. Yeah. Because you glow blue. Yep. Woo. Um, I can see it being difficult if you just can't get the timing on some of the buttoning right, but it's really not that hard, in my opinion. Um, let's set some techniques. NPC, can you switch NPC to player two? Um, can you like click NPC and then... No, this is no. just looking at his stuff. I have an idea, though. Let me um, change my skills. Okay. So I have jump and defend. So these, you want to use all of these eventually because you will unlock like different tiers of uh -huh. these. Never use that one. It's, I think it like stuns or something for a okay. second. So I'm just gonna keep it at jump and defend and you'll continue oh, okay. <laughs> You'll continue to unlock um, like further iterations of uh -huh. stuff. Same with tech special techniques. Uh, if you continue to use them, they will get stronger. Sure. So I think that's his Yai Strike. Is that an L? I think that's an I, okay. so Yai Strike. Um, yeah, and you can you get four special techniques, but you also need magic to go in there, so you kind of have to play around with it. Um, let's try something. So we can save from here. Wow, oh, this auto is totally different. Wait, okay. Uh, 2P control, auto mode, manual mode. The game, a second controller is required to play in two player mode. Okay, what is auto mode? Hmm? Whoop, uh, turn. Oh, boy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The game will assume control. Okay, put it in manual mode. Okay. And see if I can. Is that you? I, running around? I think so. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Oh, you can do that too. Okay. Yeah, uh, so set your. But sales I, we're not going to be with this guy for very long, right? So I don't need to worry no, about it. No, yeah. Um, eventually, you can go pick people up again just to do runs with you. But okay. you're way, way more equipped than I am. Okay. Really. That's fine. I'm ready to party. All right, let's go. Let's go. Main road. Ooh. Okay. I'm faster than you two. I'm... Oh. Hello? Is this thing just... We can't do anything with this? Hold on. I think something got messed up. Oh. Somehow encounters got turned off. That was very strange. 
Okay. Should Let's we go, go back reload. And... Yeah. That's so wait, you can just turn off fighting? Apparently in this now that menu is that menu is completely different. So wait, is that sprout thing something we should attack? Yes. No, it'll there we go. Uh -huh. I was like, why is there Weird. nothing going on? Okay, that's my jump. That's a like a slash. Okay. Yep. Is this B bad? Okay. <laughs> you wanna collect these too for the spear. I'm kind of in the middle of uh, wait, so what is oh circle is swing. Yep. Aha. Uh his are gonna be different than mine. I've done the thing. Bag. Here's all of our stuff. Uh, the crystal thingies are experience. Okay. Um, you usually, I think there's a ring that you can get to share between you and whoever. Sure. Oh. Yeah. I'm jumping. I'm jumping. Mm -hmm. and I'm defending. What's the defend button? Uh, for me, it's X. I think. Okay, so for me, it's like a backflip. I don't, whatever's assigned, yeah, to you. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. I'm, I'm quick go. on the draw. Again, kind of a, yeah, I love it up. Kind of a mash game. Okay. Nice animation. And that just, you check it every time. That kind of actually adds a lot of length to the game, unfortunately, is that little screen that shows up. So, I, you maybe don't know, because this is a remaster thing. If you just turn encounters off, do you just walk through the whole game? You kind of can. Uh, you do have to fight bosses. Okay, so that's gonna halt your progress. Right. Like, it kind of doesn't make sense. I was just curious if you could just be like, I'm just in scenic mode. Right, you definitely can. Obviously, we started walking by them, but mm -hmm. like, you don't get any experience. Um, here's an old school save point. So, I'm gonna save. And that's where you used to be able to just turn on two player control. Aha. I usually save, wow, it's really quick. Okay. Um, just at these points, just because sure, sometimes you can get lost. Um, here's a character. I don't think we want to talk to her right now. I'm gonna not talk to her. Oh. It's so weird that that's like a concept that you have to worry about. It's really weird. Um, trust me, I didn't understand it when I first played this game. I, mean, I, was just like, I don't eh? think anyone would intuit that mm -hmm. you're not supposed to talk to them. It's not that you're not supposed to, I just don't want to... Uh, wrong buttons. I don't want to like do the wrong thing. <laughs> At the wrong time. Wait. Okay. I think I, yeah, I think I got them. We're Ooh. good. Those guys, um, they're called chopping hoods. <gasps> sure. Ooh, cutting bamboo. Is that for me? I'm not sure. Let's check it out. Uh. I think it's crazy that you can just take control. Oh wait, I yeah, you have, I have all of all these. That stuff. Yeah. So when your thing lights up, you can press any okay. of those. There is like a charge up time though, so you should position yourself accordingly. Okay. I keep reaching for like a tiny triangle that's not here on the controller anymore. Because that's what it was on PS1 is the little triangle. And that's what this menu is. Uh, let's see if I learned that. I did. Yeah, you have cutting bamboo now. Cool. I just get okay. four abilities. Yeah, um, I don't know if he learns abilities. He might, though. So am I him good him. right now? So if I go like this, yeah. Yep. I'm going to throw this thing, I think. Yeah! There you go. Woo. Yeah, that guy's just dead now, I oh, think. Oh, see, I totally whiffed on that, because I didn't know what it was doing. Also, do try to collect everything that you can. I'm doing my best. No, I know, it goes away. So, oh, oh. I'm... I got poisoned. Is, oh, is my triangle a throw? Maybe. I can't tell. Get a long seed. Actually, it might not go away. I don't know. It just it disappears from the screen, so it doesn't idle there too long, mm -hmm. which is smart. Uh, smart game design initially. Ooh, I'm facing the wrong way. Here we go. I know you. Uh, enemies will definitely do that to you. There's one that like reverses your entire trajectory. Do we have, like, recovery items or not yet? Uh, no. You recover your health every time. It's like, in between battles? Mm -hmm. But there's no potions. No. There's things like candy, but really, you are... You're really trying to build your defense and your attack so that you just don't die. Or you can get revived, um, but you need to have more than one person in your party until you get to stand up again. Okay. 
All right, so these guys are our bandits. Uh, they want cash, cash, cash. cash, cash, cash. Don't we all? Uh, I think I'm gonna Can give them candy. Them? Candy, here you go. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they are crazy for money. Again, aren't we all? You can't stand them. Master. This is a boss. This is, is a boss. boss. This is your first boss. Nice. I'm gonna giant swing sand. him. Can, I, can you? I hope you can use giant swing on bosses. We're gonna find out. Mm, hold on. Need a little more meter. Here we go. Uh, oh, I should have defended. See, Here look at go. our Here synchro. If giant you can see swing. It. Can I? Yeah, I can. <gasps> Woo! This game rocks. And oh, he's stunned. He's stunned. Go Let's get him. Get him. I keep forgetting I have jump equipped. Oh, so when he does that, you might want to get out of the way. Speak for yourself. Oh boy. Oh, no, I don't want any of that. Okay, no. and we do our backflips. Can you jump? Is there a jump in this game? Um, you have to assign it. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't think I have one. No. Uh, we took him down. Mm. 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 Big box full of big stuff. Woo, give me all that stuff. Mm. Yummy. Delicious experience crystals. <laughs> Counterattack. Okay. I'm sad that I'm going to lose this guy as my character. I could play as this guy for a hundred hours. That's he, he hits pretty hard. Um, eventually. Ooh. Slurp. He's gonna make us rich. Iron pot, green ball bun, and a taco bug. What is, is a taco bug? That's a bug. Okay. I think it's called a taco bug because it has eight arms like an octopus, which is a taco. Okay. Yeah. Whatever you say. Normally charges 3000 but we can have them for 300 I don't have that, sir. What? You don't even have 300 Seriously? Turn out your pockets. Dude, I thought we just defeated the bandits. Now he's the bandit. Uh, not... Yeah, you don't have enough. You don't have enough. That's all right. This is a special one-time only offer. Okay. Get it anyway. If you had 300, would he charge you that? No. This is part of the cutscene. So it's impossible to have 300 by this point? No, not necessarily. Okay. I don't think he would take it from you anyway. Okay. I don't. I think that this is just part of the story. So we got another artifact. So artifacts are levels. Let's make that clear, right? I guess, yeah. I guess they're the dungeons. I, I like to call them the lands. Okay. It's like they're bigger than just inside a cave or whatever. Okay. Um, Interestingly enough, they've spelled out artifact instead of AF. It, it used to be AF up top. But I think that's a little confusing because AF can stand for anything. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I'm what not are we? frowning. Okay. I'm smiling. Let the world know you're happy. After all, I am a merchant. I want to make my customers happy. Okay. I enjoy life and you should too. <laughs> oh, adios. I'm such a nice guy. Smile. I'm done with this guy forever. He no. has so many moves. No, you're not. I okay. Promise. I promise. This I... is just Nicola's business, unusual one. Okay. That's the end of his story. Wow. All for right. now. Yeah. So, is the game like linear like that? Like, will we? There are. I'm sure there are side quests, but like, that was the end of his story. It's like a story event. And okay. all of these events, for the most part, some of them are self-contained in that there will only be one. Some mm -hmm. of them are part of a longer story chain in the game. Um, yeah, a lot of them are one-offs. I would say more of them are one-offs, but you still get to know characters that might come up in other stories mm -hmm. or that are just in other parts of the world or whatever. But yeah, you'll, you'll find out. Um, every time you finish an event, you're going to go home and you're going to talk to this guy. And he's gonna say nothing? Oh, no. Money crazy. He'll give you like a one word or two word answer and then you're gonna run away. <laughs> okay. And then he stands up and he goes and does that. He writes in his diary. Okay. Yeah. You don't wanna forget because if you save, if you start another event without talking to him, uh, he won't put it in his diary. Why does that matter? Uh, It's for collection, like completionist sake. Okay. Uh, let's go down. They're like 50, 60? Okay, so 67. there's 67 
quests. Okay. Events, quests, yeah. So, sure, um, okay. And then you can save at your bed. I can save over this. Yep. Gosh, that's fast. <laughs> but I, um, and then we're gonna move on to the next one. There's really not anything to do at home yet. Um, it's really just talking to a little. I guess I should put saving. my controller down, huh? Yeah, I think you can for now. Oh. We're gonna go actually get some other playable characters right now. Okay. Will you ever have more than two dudes in your party, or? Um, I think. Even though we're picking up two mm -hmm. for the future right now, all in one go, I think you can only have one like humanoid NPC and then one pet and then one golem. Like you can't have a pet and a golem, I don't think, unless they change that. I guess we'll find out. Yeah, and I don't. I know you can't have more than one NPC, um, unless they change that. So we'll figure it out. I think it would be kind of OP if you had like both of these characters that mm -hmm. you're about to pick up. And this is our lovely resident male bird. She's very nice, and she's talking about pumpkins taking over the west half of Domino, which this, is kind of scary. This lady has strong Animal Crossing energy. She does. She's very cute. Like, I could imagine her pulling mail out of her mouth sack. Yeah, out of her... What is the word for that? I don't know what they call it's the... It's probably she's a not pelican. mouth sack. <laughs> so we're going to go help her because she wants to do her jobby job, which, hey, I don't blame her. She's got a lot of mail and stuff to mm -hmm. deliver. Uh, it's very, very scary. Yes, I agree. And there she goes. She's a bird, but she's gonna walk off instead of fly. Goodbye, bird. Bye, bird. All right, let's go. This guy doesn't have any new info for us ever until like the end of the game. Maybe I'm not sure. He just hangs out at your house. I, I don't know what he's doing. There. He, yeah, it's none of your business what he's it's doing. None of my business. He's a sproutling. So we got two lands here. Is that does that mean we can do to two different places? Yes, those we have will be that, different like, places. Locket and a flaming anchor. It's a flame, yeah. So that's okay. a medallion and a flame. Uh, we're not gonna touch those quite yet. Okay. We saw business in Domino. All right, let's go. I forgot. I have to like really, really mm -hmm. push. It's weird to have your little NPC like on the painted path. That's what I'm so saying. Tiny. It, it feels a little like I almost just wish they had just done everything in the new style yeah. rather than the pixel art. That would be a controversial statement. I just, I don't like this look as much as I would have preferred. Like, hey, you, like. It's understandable. It, I, it's a little rough on the eyes, um, especially because we're on like a 55 inch TV. Right, and this is on a <laughs> PS5. Again, I might be revealing too much about myself here. I think Dragon's Crown looks incredible. And I think if you're going to just do the art like this, mm -hmm. you might as well just do the characters too, because it's not like the characters in that game look so good. Sure. But um, again, though, remaster, not remake. Yeah. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I mean, it would have been. I think it would have taken a long time to really remake everything. Oh well, yeah, you'd be doing it basically from the ground up. Right, 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 yeah. right. And I get it. I understand. I think you rearranged some of the music mm. too, which. For me, I didn't need that. The original soundtrack is beautiful. Um, was it like um, chip tunes, or is it? Was I think it, it like is this? chip tunes, but a lot of it was like this. It, this kind of sounds cleaned up now that I think about it. Mm -hmm. um, oh, this is a new track, like newly rearranged track for sure. Mm -hmm. Totally sounds different, but in not a bad way. I think we can turn the original music back on if we want to too. So. Some really good songs in this game. <laughs> Alright, so this is uh, two little sorcerers. Mm -hmm. There's a guy and there's a girl. Uh, he wants to take over the world. She's skeptical, because how do you rule the world with pumpkins? No, I think it makes perfect sense. No, I think she's not on board. Hmm. So, oh, we're going to get stopped. This is Bud the Malignant. Mm -hmm. Great of, name. Of course. Yeah. Do I get to be Bud the Malignant, or is he not? He's You'll not see. a homie. You'll see. Um, he wants us to kneel if we know it's good for us. <laughs> Why don't you get your pumpkins to do that instead? Sure. Right after we teach the scum a lesson. Scum, harsh word, man. Jeez, you really need to chill out. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're fighting them. Yes, I have to. You're fight fighting them. both of them. 
Oh god. Oh god. I think you want to dodge that. Yep. Do they both have two life bars? No. Are you sure? Uh, I'm not sure. Wow. I was this, gonna... is, this feels rough on this controller, I'm not gonna lie. Everything is so much faster. Like, yeah, it feels like there's a delay is... you kind of have to get used to here. Yeah. Like, there's just a slight delay that. on some of your movement, and I... Yeah, everything's very quick. I don't know if that's... In, like, a way that I've... I'm just not remembering it being... These out. guys are messing yeah, you up. Yeah, they really are, though. I'm really trying to get used to this here. I wonder if there's any controller... Okay. And I keep mistaking my moves, too, because I had them set differently before. Could you be bringing a party into this encounter, or do you have no. to... You have to solo these guys? Yes, you have to solo them, because okay. you don't... You don't get to... Mm -hmm. Why am I defending? Okay, jump. That is that. I feel like they almost... Maybe... There you go, that seemed like good damage. Yeah. God. I don't, yeah, I don't think See, you want to be there anymore. Oh boy. You get stuck a little bit in... Fortunately, the magic moves. seems like it doesn't do a devastating amount of damage. There no. you go. Also, you are in invincible. There we go. But they're not frozen when you're charging. I see what you're saying about that. Right. Ow. That kind of hurt. Oh, so it's... Uh, okay, I, I was going to say, it looked like you healed a little bit there off that. Maybe. Uh, maybe? You do recover, you, you over, recover time. over time. recover over time. Okay, okay. You do have invincibility frames when you're charging up and stuff, mm -hmm. though. I think, I think I need to change my buttons because it doesn't seem... Yeah, they have two health bars. Jeez. Rough. Mm-hmm. It's okay. It's it's better to just take one. Oh boy, take one of them down. Oh doesn't, god. Hopefully oh god. that doesn't empower the other. Ah. No, it doesn't. It's not that advanced. I promise. Oh, oh, oh. She, yeah, she's gonna now. She says I'm gonna do k k k k k now. Luckily, um, a lot of attacks are pretty easy to avoid if you just go to the side of the screen, which is pretty like that era of gaming. Mm -hmm. So you can also interrupt them get him in time. Ah, that yeah. seems the, like the key. To yeah, this, it is. I'm not just... letting them cast. There we go. Oh boy. Uh, he pushed, oh, he that pushed me from the back. Lame. Yeah. That's okay. I'm not gonna. Hopefully, I'm not gonna die. Yeah. Now that there's just one, I think you can just party on him. It's weird that they can just get away from you when you charge like that. Oh, That's that whiff is so bad. Uh huh. It's hard. With two people, I feel like oh, that oh, would oh. really be easier because one can juggle oh, while the other's setting up the ult. Yeah. It's okay. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to have to fight them. I did. I have died on them before. Oh my gosh. God. I, I mean, Ugh. you know. Yep, yep, yep. 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 Okay. The trades. Yep. There we go. Ow. Can you can you anticipate that attack and block it? Yes, but I don't block in this game very much. I think it's you should, just you should block. it's very hard to block because I'm not used to using that move at all. Okay, this guy, he seems to be letting you, okay. I'm just not used to it. It's just, it's really hard. Also, because of the considerable, I feel like, delay at this point, like, switching to it feels like it freezes you faster. Okay. The, the, I, I must explain for the viewer. <laughs> the movement and attacking in this game does not feel like something like Streets of Rage. No. It's much more like, I hate to, to invoke it here, but it feels more Kingdom Heartsy in that, like, you move forward and then you move. You attack and then you attack. Right. Not like you attack with a button. It's like you move forward, then you right. move forward. And there's a little bit of prediction that you can do when you continue to play, mm -hmm. but um, it's why I'm not using the analog stick because it moves you forward way too it, quickly. It feels very strange. That's why I'm <laughs> using the D pad, and I've always used the D pad in this game. Because of that. Takes some um, getting used to. Let's yeah, say. I think I'm just going to have to switch my buttons around too. Just me. Because I think I had my attacks on different buttons when mm -hmm. I used to play. So, not a big deal. Uh, this is Lisa. She's adorable. Um, yes. Please be my apprentice. Can I play as her? Yes. Okay, cool. So, you're recruiting them as Brent says they are now two player characters that live in your house. Wow, I'm, I'm so kind. Yes. I do try to be. Okay, that takes care of them. Mm -hmm. Gotta stay hydrated. Summertime. And if you see up in the left corner too, 
the little sprout, mm -hmm. it'll turn into something big eventually. Okay, so that's that. Is that game progress, or is that like an overarching thing that Pretty is happening? Much. Yeah, that's game progress um, and like land placement progress. Uh huh. Yeah. So it kind of it's the game showing you that hey, you're, you're growing. doing something. Yeah, you're doing good. Okay. So now they're in your house. Yay! Oh, both are. I, I kind of yeah. thought this was an invite for just one of them, but no, he's in the background like flipping out or doing whatever, and she just brings them with. Her. Okay, so we tell the cactus that we did that. Yep. Scary pumpkins, he says. Okay. We gonna give him some privacy. Right and then he is gonna run over there. Yep. Do it. He's like, all right, peace out. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. Cool. So that was that. I think we're gonna start getting like building out the house. Mm -hmm. Um. I don't think we have to fight anybody in this next one. Okay. Okay. Do all of your party members end up in this house? No. No. Okay. No, it does not become like a big like condo where everybody uh -huh. hangs out. It's not a gamer house. It's not anything okay, like it's, that. Was, that's what I was going to ask is It's literally just them because like they're kids basically okay. and they need to apprentice somewhere to become like successful mages or whatever in the world uh so yeah whatever you guys can stay here just don't make a mess of the place is kind of the attitude also it's easy access to npcs that you will use to play with um <laughs> Okay. And you can build their stats for them. Those ones you should be actively building their stats. Because you can pick them up at any time. Some quests will require you to take one of them with you. Okay. Yep. Uh, we're gonna go, we're gonna ignore these guys, even though they're playing a lovely tune. If I have to go all the way back, that sucks, but I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go all the way out here. Yes. Okay, this, this seems good. Here's a tutorial. <laughs> a very brief tutorial. Sure. That's a monster egg. Uh, that one is a beast type egg. Never see wild eggs around here. Well, now we will. Man, the, the Onion Knight's portrait looks so much like... Like Zuka? Yeah. Yeah. Like with the mouth and everything. Like if you told me that that was like... Like there was art of that character on their wall while they were drawing her, I would totally believe <laughs> Possibly. it. Possibly. You never know, honestly. Like, cause they're even wearing the dresses kind of like she does, right? A little bit. It's hard to tell in the pixel art. Uh -huh. um, you can find their art, I think, in the encyclopedia. So we can go look through that at some point. Yeah. And look at the full page color art. Um, so this is a rare opportunity, apparently. We're going to try and catch this thing. A beast type egg. Beast is just the monster type it'll become. Uh, you can never tell exactly what monster it'll grow up to be. Super RNG. Like, okay. you can that's get- That's not said at all anywhere. No, so the types of eggs are RNG usually, um, but a couple types will prefer to spawn in certain areas. Okay. Like in the jungle, you can't get, you can only get a couple types, but the exact monster that it turns out to be is totally RNG. There's some really rare ones that come out of their certain type. Um, some people literally spending hours trying to get the right monster. A lot of resetting to do that. It seems excessive, unless the game more. Uh, I mean, maybe on higher difficulties, on higher it's difficulties, more important. But... Yeah, to get a really good monster really helps you out. Mm -hmm. I always just took a rabbit with me all the time. He got it to level 99. He hit pretty hard. Okay. Yeah. Ten different types. Ooh. There's a lot of monsters in this game. I'll try to catch it. Not so fast. You can't just stroll up to an egg like that, it's watching you. True. It doesn't have eyes. It just has fangs, right? Uh, yeah, I... but... Uh, no, it doesn't have eyes. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, that's just fangs. Carefully. Don't stand in front of it, you'll only scare it. True. Uh, they run away very quickly. Mm -hmm. um, gotta keep your eyes on the egg. Don't want to miss any sign as to what it's thinking. You'll see. Uh, off guard? What does that mean? They like to eat. When they're full, they fall asleep, you catch them. So a little bit of Pokemon sort of in here. Mm. Yeah, you don't want it to see you. 
even though it doesn't have eyes. Okay. Yeah. It can sense you, I guess. It can feel your presence. Great. Echolocation. Okay. We got a dice berry. Yeah, bell grapes. Bell grapes. And citrus squid. Oh yeah. All right. <laughs> All the funny fruits in this game. And fruit is only used for these guys. You don't eat them. So fruit is also used to modify weapons and armor and golems. You can use it for stats and also to paint things. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. This game is. You should get after that guy. Nuts. <laughs> ah, he sees me. Can you scare him off screen? And no. then it's over? Okay. No. So we're gonna... Okay. We can kind of edge them toward the fruit sometimes. Mm -hmm. It's gonna bump into me and freak out and... Oh, we did it! Oh, oh no. Not... Whoa. Oh, he's upset. Oh, he's going that way. So do these... I, you know, I think I'm just gonna let it... I, I, did he... Wait, did he always have a tail? Yeah. yeah, okay. It was behind him. Oh, I think he's honing in on the fruit. Mmm, <gasps> it's blood. So you should party on him now, right? If no? he falls asleep. Oh, he's asleep. Yeah, he's asleep. It's mine. Okay. And our lovely pelican friend will deliver him to our house. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> um, cool. Just confirming what we already knew. Let's go over there. Sweet. This is the monster crawl. Three monsters outside and a bunch inside. Um, I think there's a cap though, how many you can have inside. You can also sell them, which is mm -hmm. But yeah, that's how you get gold too. Yep. Okay. I wonder if they changed any of this menuing. It's a little confusing. This is where monsters are kept. Five monster eggs on your travels. Okay. Catch them. them. You can have five at a time. Okay, five pets. Uh, crowd's full. Okay, you sell, sell it. it. Yeah. Okay. Sell the one that you don't really like. Okay. Wow. They do have different personalities too. Of course they do. <laughs> okay. This game is nuts. <laughs> Jennifer from the item shop in Domina will buy them from you. Yep. Okay. She can be a tightwad, but she's the only buyer around. Well, I mean. Yeah, if she's setting the whole economy, then I. Yeah, why I wouldn't think she's you? allowed to nickel and dime you a little bit. Anyway, eggs take a few days to hatch. Fully grown monsters will become very attached to you and will follow you everywhere. Okay, so I don't control them. Those are like the third wheel in the party. Kinda, yeah. yeah. I don't know if you can control them or not. I don't think so, though. I think the monster, like in the menu, has its own thing. Okay. Kind of like how NPC does, or player two. Okay. You take them out, battle them, blah da 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 da. Mm hmm. Monsters diet affects its growth. True. Different foods, which we will be able to grow soon. They will only eat after they gain a level. Okay. Yeah. So if you have like five and you just have food in their boxes and they're not eating, you have to take them out or else you're doing it wrong. Okay. Yep. Now we know what to do. How your monsters grow up is entirely up to you. Well then. Well then. See you later, dude. Thanks for the tutorial about monsters. See ya, onion guy. <laughs> oh, okay, that's another quest down. Yep. The rabbi is one of the cutest in the game. But we don't know what we got until we get there. Like with this first egg. Right. Um, we're gonna go home. Okay. Oh, well, no. Something. Something's. Oh, no. You're loading into home. Okay. Yes. Just so we can make sure to log that quest. You can end up skipping this. Um, I think if you go somewhere else. Uh, yeah, again, I, the, the the tediousness of using the guide, I feel like we are just trying not to miss. Yeah, I really don't want to miss it because in the end, you can. A lot of this stuff of will eventually matter in a substantial way, right? I mean, the diary really is for completionist's sake. There might be be a certain number of entries you need for another quest. Whoa, um, so this is th that one you just did isn't even one of the... Right. So it's, it's just somewhere, somewhere in that's there. A, that is a side quest completely, like down at the bottom of the list. Okay. Right. Um, 
you should do it sooner rather than later though because if it you seems do it super important. late yeah if yeah. you do it super late you'll never know but like the game never tells you hey go over to <sighs> the west side of domina and go talk to that guy okay. it never does it really wants you to like wander around and find this out and it's like oh you can totally miss this until like the very end okay there's a diary entry now my master can bring back eggs of other animals to raise them as pets I can't pet them because I'm all spiky, but humans will be okay because they aren't spiky like me. Too true. Lil Cactus has a really funny sense of humor. He's kind of like a little kid. Okay. Um, my master beat banditos with a creature called Niccolo. Niccolo is scared of the banditos, but I'm scared to know what Niccolo is. What could he possibly be? He's just a rabbit guy. I don't think it's that weird. You're a talking cactus. He's a talking cactus, but he doesn't know any better. Today okay. I heard a story about two little sorcerers trying to become the rulers of this world. But pumpkins? They use pumpkins? Okay. I hope they're still yummy. So when you talk to the cactus, the insinuation is that you're telling him about your quest. You're telling him the story but of you what can't, happens. But you can't stack stories for him? Like you have to go nope. there and tell him? It has to be every single time after every single quest. That is a choice. It's a choice. And they give you the choice to do that or not, which mm -hmm. I think is interesting. Um, yeah, it's it's pretty funny actually okay. um we're gonna just go judge the world a little bit um push some stuff forward yeah so we can go get our monster and take it with us so every time you run across and um the top right changes that's a game day okay Boop. Boop. you don't have to enter the land until you confirm again with x so you're just traveling there to change the day? Yeah, we're moving the days forward. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna land on a particular day. Just trying to make sure that the egg hatches. It should hatch by now. Okay, so you can just sort of brute force that? Yeah, there are quests that require you to come back in like on a certain day, mm -hmm. like Dryad Day or Undine Day or whatever, um, which can get frustrating because sometimes it takes a little bit. Uh, let's go see. Did he hatch? Can't move. Yay! Hey, hello. We got a little rabbit. What do we want to name him? It or... Why don't you... I mean, you could just swing the auto a couple times and see what it you gives wanna you. You want to try? Yeah, why not? That's usually the way you come up with the best names anyway. Rabbit. Okay, <laughs> try that again. Nope. That's not random. That is literally auto. That is not a random name. Uh, nope. No, you're not trying very hard. <laughs> okay. Auto Rabbite. No, I guess it doesn't want We could just leave it as Rabbite, no, I guess. No, that's so boring. Uh, Let's call him something cute. Do you have a name queued up? Not really. Um. How about Rito? How do you spell that? Uh, R-I... Uh, Rito? Yeah. T O like that. Rito. Rito? Yeah. Okay. Rito the rabbi. That works for me. Alright. Alright. Yeah. Hold on. I wanna see something really quick. Sure. Is there a special name that gives him special properties? Is that what you're about what to tell me? This. Oh. Um I wanna see if that symbol made it in. The heart symbol? Not the heart symbol. So they also Funnily enough, like, now that I'm remembering this randomly, I don't know, like, why? Yes, you could have, like, dollar, like, currency symbols. Mm -hmm. So, there were gender symbols as well uh -huh. back in the day in their little built-in thing. Um, I never really used them for my animals or anything, but it was just something that you could do. Mm -hmm. Probably two, in case you had two of the same or three of the same pet and you were trying to get the best stats on them. Uh, we're gonna take him. Sure, I mean, he gets experience by fighting, right? Right. Um, we do want to bring him back to feed him eventually, mm -hmm. but uh, we don't need to do that now. He'll be fine. We don't have any fruit, really, other than what we were given. And he just follows you forever now? Uh, yeah, until we drop him back off. Um, when you're in the yard and they're like running around doing their, doing their thing, like you can pet them. And then you'll see their personalities too. So it's really cute. Okay, we're going back to Domina. Woo. 
Okay. We... Are we allowed to talk to the mysterious guy yet, or no? Not quite yet. Whose name I can't... Elazul. Elazul, uh, yep. It's a play on Lazuli, because that's kind of his <laughs> demeanor, like his gem. He's a... He's a race of people that has okay. gems attached to them. Okay. Uh... We're not gonna... We're gonna get around this right now. Sure. I trust you. I think so. Oh wait, we're in the wrong place. Oops. We will come back to that. I always confuse the pub with the inn. We want to go to the inn, not the pub. Okay. Uh, this is Miss Yuka. That's her baby back there. Uh, okay. This is the guy you can save at these guys. They're this is just cool. a save point guy? Mm -hmm. They're also shopkeepers in other towns. They're okay. pretty cool. Uh, sometimes they have some really nice items. He doesn't have anything. Uh, hi. Welcome to Mana's Blessing. That's her inn. It's Miss Yuka. She's a giant canary. Cool. We only okay. Go upstairs. That guy just works the front desk? Yeah. Which? Okay. It's her inn. Why doesn't she work the front desk? She's, I don't know. She's going around talking to people. Uh, we got bird meat from, well, from this chest over here uh, randomly. What's the insinuation of that? It's meat made from a bird. Okay. In a chest that somebody was keeping. And now it's ours. Okay. Oh, that's a mage. What's he doing up here? He's selling minerals. What does he have? He has a lot of very expensive stuff. Um, all of this is farmable. Yeah. It's very expensive. And it all will help you with better weapons and armor. And uh, instruments. Okay. Let's see if the person that we're looking for is in here. Yes, there she is. We saw okay. her on the highway. But we didn't want to talk to her before. No. So now we want to talk to Dana. Can what I do we play know? as Dana? I think so. Okay. What do we know about the monetary? Um, we know this and that about it. <laughs> this and that. You don't have to play along. There's no such thing. I know that. Oh, boy. Okay. What happens to our souls after we die? They live forever. Well, the other guy said they disappear. Right. So... We're gonna tell her they live forever, because if we don't, I think that we don't get her as a companion. We can still do the next quest, but okay. we don't get to take her. She also thinks that souls live forever. I've been wounded a hundred times and no foe has ever hurt my soul. It's very poetic. I can't believe that my soul would ever disappear. I wanna go meet Gaia. Sure. I'll go with you. Go by yourself. This is so mean. Thank you. I knew you'd say that. She's super cool. I like her. She's one of my favorite characters. Let's go. Oh. Okay. Uh, apparently we're calling the... Tr okay. Did it not... Was it called something different originally? It never used to be Gaia. It used to be Gaius. And Gaius is... Or Gaius, maybe, but... Okay, so they just shortened they it to Gaia. just shortened it to Gaia, I guess? I feel like we've all sort of accepted that the world tree... When it, it but we're pertains. not going to the world tree. We're going to go talk to a wisdom, and he was always a guy. So okay. I'm wondering why we're calling him Gaia. Oh, wait, is this me? Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Did it automatically? Yep. I'll that's back so in. cool. Okay, that's really cool. Okay. Do you want to check like your stuff? No, I will be fine. Okay. Uh, hold on. Let me see if I can do it from here. Oh. Let me like mess around with my. Sure. My stuff, real quick. So, let's... You could, it's weird that you can only have two at a time. When you well, have those so are my things... abilities. They're not... But there's so many things you can do, you know? Right. I thought I could change X and square. Maybe not. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. You gotta just choose what Triangle, you want them circle. to do. Oh, man. That's kind of... Triangle annoying. and circle are just your attack buttons. They so. are, but I could have sworn I could use... X as an attack button and square as an attack button before. I don't remember, honestly. It was so, a long time okay. ago. <laughs> Real talk, I think it's actually mega lame that, like, you, I feel like your special techniques are the ones that should be assigned to one button and you should have to pick which one you want. Mm -hmm. These utility buttons, you like being like, you the can abilities choose, you mean? You can choose two abilities. It's like, why can't I just have access to all of these and make your super like one button mm -hmm. and you can pick if you want EI strike or cutting bamboo because that takes your whole bar anyway. Right. You know what I mean? Or can yeah. you can you map? 
before I speak too soon. No, that's just magic. I don't yeah, know. that's a weird decision in it's my It's weird that I can repeat these here, too. It, right, exactly. It's like, there's so many abilities that you don't have access to, and mm -hmm. yet you can just put as many of the same special techniques on the bumpers as you want. It's like, why would you design it that we way? I don't have any magic yet, though. Would it be overpowered if you had the ability to backstab at the same time that you had backstep? Like, I, I don't... I don't know. I feel like that's kind of a bug, though, to be able to do both of them at the same time. I mean, it's just you can map. Or you can I, just... I don't know why you would ever want to do that, but you certainly can. Well, you don't have any. You have two. So yeah. just in case you're in battle and you're like, ah, and you're just pressing buttons uh -huh. to make sure that you get your special technique off. But, um, gosh, I don't. Maybe we'll have defend as square and excess jump. Let's try that. There's Dana, she's kind of beefy. Mm -hmm. right I'll now. be all right. Yeah. I just want to see where her skills are. Oh, yeah. Push toss. She's cool. Uh, let's see. Our pet doesn't really have any skills. Um, he gets a shitload of essences and I'm stuff sure. as you feed him. I'm sure he'll get there. Yeah, so he hasn't had a snack yet, but he will. Okie dokie. We're not placing any lands yet. These are just your cursory. I trust it. No, again, yeah, you know. When you said I need to follow a guide, I didn't believe how necessary it was. But now that we're here, I feel like there's so many just mistakes you could make. Right. I trust this guide implicitly because it has been on its. Own. There goes Blank. Let him go. He's cool. Um, it has been on. Don't touch him. Oh, Pretty. I press triangle. Sorry. Don't touch him. He'll transport you somewhere that you don't want to go. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't think I can interact with uh, okay. NPCs like that. Yeah, he'll transport you to like the middle of the map. If you ever see his tail doing this, you'll see his little tail like sticking up. That's okay. what that means. Um, we're just going to fall. But this guide has been up on its own dedicated website for over a decade, if not longer. <laughs> yeah, it's... The perfect run. Yep. Yeah. Um, the person who runs the website is a hero to all of us. <laughs> nice. Look how fast she is. When I say that, like, grinding for things like clear feathers is totally something you want to do way later, mm -hmm. you're going to be here for a while. It's it's so nutty, like, how much of an ingredient that you need for, like, swords. No. Super insanely high-powered weapons and armor. Um, people have spent years and so much time um, putting together I'm recipes. And stuff like, oh my god, I I can't imagine like <laughs> mm -hmm. how much time it's taken. I'm gonna save her because we haven't put her in the party. Okay. Just in case we mess up. Sure. Yeah. I'm pretty confident, but. <sighs> Uh, we're gonna go there's the lower a fork right. In the right. Yep. <laughs> That's where Dana was, and now we're going this way. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. The. Oh, okay. Did I, you just do that? I did a back nice. attack, but I did it from the front, which seems like the wrong move. But there we go. X to jump feels so much better. So all we got there was seeds, which will come in handy. Oh, uh, we don't... Okay. The... <laughs> that bush is in the background, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> this map is fairly straightforward. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not very confusing. Um, I'll tell you which ones are confusing. Like... Oh, boy. You definitely need a guide if you don't want to get lost on some maps. Looks like you can't push us forward either. I can't. I Yeah, I'm purely here to assist you in battle, and that's about it. Got which it. Is... Hey, you that's know what? Fine. That's fine with me. I have no idea what I'm doing. Look. So. This canyon is named after you, the player character. So this is Pluma Canyon. Okay. Yep. It's pretty cool. Oops. Is the insinuation that you're like an adventurer from the other game or no? What do you mean from the other game? Like, why is it Pluma's Canyon? Um. Like, it's I, not. I honestly couldn't tell you. Okay. Like, that was something that was in the original game. And I always remember being like... Why is this named after me? Like, who named it after me? Right, right. Like, like, what is... Yeah, what does that have to do... What does this canyon have to do with me? I feel like the nunchucks are very strong. Yeah. What is that? Like a... 
there's you can get them as a character. I know, I saw in the beginning. Yeah. That's meat. Let's go. Here we go. Oh, so interesting that they changed his name. I don't know why they did that. Sir, uh, wake up, please. How do we go? Oh, here oh, we go. There you here go. We go. Oh, this guy. Yeah. Yeah, this guy was in the intro. Yeah. Okay. We are going to come closer. Sure. Okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Wee. All the cinematic looks so much better. Like, it's so cleaned up. Hello there. What do you wish to know? My friend is dying from a demon's curse. What can I do to help her? Do what your friend wants you to do. <laughs> Thanks for nothing, dude. I actually think that's amazing advice, though. She won't even ask me for help. She thinks that this is just how things are meant to be. Mm -hmm. Then you must accept that. Okay, yeah, sure. Do you understand what she's trying to tell you? No. No, I don't! I just don't get why she's giving up like this. She was always so strong, but that demon weakened her in body and spirit. I only want to help her get back to her old self. People have the power to make their own decisions. That is what she is trying to teach you. Listen to her words. Okay. Or maybe she just doesn't know if there's any way for her to help her. Maybe. And she just doesn't know. Perhaps. But okay, thanks, Perhaps. giant living rock monster. <laughs> we don't really know, because we, you know, we're just an outsider here. We're just hearing this story from her side. Uh-huh. I'll try to take a more level-headed approach. By the way, Pluma. Oh, yeah. By the by. Me? Me? Should be an ancient tree beside your house. Okay. Do you do you know him? He will help you with many things. You are welcome to return anytime. Cool. Maybe we might. Also, you can never go like in that cave. It's just a dumb thing. I yeah, always wanted I, to. That's what I thought it was—a cave, <laughs> but apparently not. Okay. Oh, we're gonna get something. We got a forbidden ring, which is. Oh. Okay. And we don't and have I to go back through. Yep. Set my controller down the world. once more. Yeah. She had four special attacks with four unique abilities, and she's just gone now. Yep. Okay. We're your home. Let's go. Whee. I'm really glad that you don't have to go back through most of the time i think they don't force you to retrace your steps very often mm -hmm. um which kind of sucks for grinding but at the same time it's like oh i got all the way here i made so many twists and turns i don't know what's happening i'm sure there's a lot more retreading if you don't know where you're going right yeah, yeah. Um, happened to me a bajillion times i am sure it happened to most every single person yep dot 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 we're gonna talk to him big face big face sure it's not his name but that's how you remember him. Okay. I like his little do -do 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 sound. It's cute. Okay, cool. That's great. Um, it did auto save, which is different now. Right. Um, I still like to save anyway. Sure. It's also a thing of the past um, that you would want to save a lot, not only to reload. Let's see, let's find that ring. Where's that ring? Right there. What does okay. it do? It just switches it. Um, you want to save a lot because you're on like a little physical card. And... Why am I having a hard time with this? I don't know where the ring goes. I don't in know what armor. slot it goes into. I think it goes in all of these. Yep. What, what does it do? So this... Oh, magic defense. Yeah. Ups your magic. Um, uh -huh. Let's see what that iron pot do. But... And it doesn't do much. Okay, let's put the other thingy back on. Yeah, just use the... yeah. Maybe better? Oh, way better. Yeah. Cool. Um, yeah, so you're saving on, like, a physical card, and, like, those cards could shit the bed sometimes, too, or your PlayStation could. Mm -hmm. So it's very, like, ingrained in me to just save, save, save whenever I can. It's... We it's, are playing on a PlayStation 5. I know. I don't think that's a realistic concern. There's auto-saving now. It's crazy. Like, yeah. that was very nice of them to put that in, too. Okay. We're gonna go check out our garden, yo. Let's go. Okay, we gotta meet the tree next door. Yeah. Okay. That's straight down. 
Okay. Yeah. I think you gotta. I'm gonna fight these dudes. Yeah. This place needs weeding. Oh god, sounds like my backyard. I actually probably could have brought you with me. I just realized I forgot that we had to fight here. Well, how would you have done? I mean, I think I would ask them to come with me. Okay, can we please get on the same level? Thanks. <laughs> I think my, my animal's gonna die. He's doing his best, though. Oh. I'm dizzy. Oh boy. Jump it away. Get over there. Alright. I'm whiffing. Looking super bad, y'all. There we go. Oh, that so didn't kill him. If your guy's down, he's just down for the fight, right? No, you'll see his bar coming back. Okay. That's why it's great to have two, because I have been in so many boss battles in this game where I've just kind of not had great luck. Mm -hmm. And I'll die a couple times, and he'll still be alive and manage to make it. And then I'll be able to just oh, auto the revive. Game, the game is not over until everybody's down. Right. Okay. So you. Your bunny can like be at 1% health and you can just auto revive and then you can die. Mm. And it's fine for you and you can beat the boss. Yay. Oh. And a big tree sprouted out of the ground. Oh, that just all happened at once. Yes. O okay. That was the earthquake. The mana energy is flowing into me. Is it you who brought me the blessing of mana? Thank you. Thank you, young one. You're welcome, I guess. You're welcome, dude. Okay, cool. We're gonna talk what, to him. What was that? A basement over there? Was that there before? What that? Yeah. Oh, it's a that... trunk. Oh, it's a trunk. Yeah, it's okay. not a basement. <laughs> Whoa, his art. That is not what he looked like <laughs> in the original game. Um, it's very high def. Absorb the mana energy of Fadiel to make air. Yep. We circulate the okay. mana, source of all things. So it's like universal energy theory, kind of. Supply seeds with mana so they can grow. You have any seeds? Let me take them. Is there any reason you shouldn't give him the seeds? No. Okay. You should pretty much it's always. Worth asking. Yeah, you should start giving him seeds like as soon as you can. Mm -hmm. This is mostly RNG. Um, there are seeds. You'll get better seeds, but like. It's mostly RNG. Some seeds and combos are more likely to grow others, like other fruit than some other ones. But sure. Yeah, it's mostly RNG. I think you can give him four at a time. Yep. So let's give him a big seed. Sometimes you don't want to give him seeds only because you need them mm -hmm. as ingredients for other stuff. Um, you definitely want to keep as many seeds as possible, though. There's a couple types of seeds that are very hard to farm. Like, in a regular playthrough, you might get... Oh, we should go talk to our cactus. You might get, like, Wait, five. Why? Did we finish a mission there? Yeah. We did? Yeah, that was the mana orchard. I know, it went by in the did blink of an eye. Did we get a completion screen? I don't know if you do. No? I was going to say, you didn't get a completion oh, screen yet. Oh, 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 Maybe oh, oh. you have to wait for the flowers to bloom. Or, that's not the what flowers. Fruit, yeah, the fruits to grow. Yeah, I got ahead of myself. Just wanted to move on. Yeah, yeah, no, I gotcha. Yeah, so we got to do the same thing. Uh, go and walk around, mm -hmm. take, take a jaunt across the land. It's weird that that's the most efficient way to do it. Yeah, like, if I, you have a bunch waiting to grow, you're just going to want to do this. Like, a bunch. It's weird that time moves even though you're not doing missions on these screens. That's a, uh, again, yeah. another, that is a choice. Yep. Um, the insinuation is that, like, when you're regularly growing stuff everywhere, mm -hmm. you're going to be on missions going back and forth anyway, so then by the time you get home, all your shit will have grown, <laughs> hopefully. Yeah. Um, if you don't have this correct land placement, though, with mm -hmm. your elements, uh, your fruit will suffer for it, and some things will never grow. Of course. Some things will start growing and just never grow. And I've had to, like, delete fruit, basically, off the tree that didn't grow. Mm -hmm. Like, it'll start as, like, a bud, and then you're like, why isn't that growing? Because you didn't do the thing right, dummy. So, that's why a guide is kind of important. To I, I believe it. Maximizing, yeah, yeah that... I'm not really a min-maxer of games, but like this one, I feel like really needs it. I feel it. like there's a right and a wrong way to do this. Yes. 
So, woo, we got some fruit. Wow. All different fruits. Wow. That's so nice. I wonder if they tweaked any of the RNG, too, now that I'm thinking about it. Come on, let's pick, let's pick the puppy. Oh, God. There we go. Peach puppy. Yeah. All the fruits are pretty much, like, animal-based or, like, object-based. Mm -hmm. Yep, there we go. We're going to have to go back and grab those. Now it's over. Yes. I was going to say, I was like, I'm staring right at the screen. I don't think <laughs> I sorry. saw a completion screen. <laughs> I'm sorry. I got so excited. <laughs> We're going to go home. Um, I think we gave him four seeds. So I think that yields like six to eight fruit, depending. Okay. If he's too full, like if he's growing, you can A, can't give him seeds. And B, he won't grow more if you do like give him seeds. Does that make sense? Yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> enough sense as much sense as anything you were saying makes sure like if we went and gave him one seed now he might not be able to grow whatever it is until we harvest all of these so you don't really want to back him up because that and is just not efficient are these all for your beast uh yeah um you can feed your pets you can use they all have like properties so that's why feeding your pets different foods is good um, you can use them to paint stuff, like I said. Uh, there will be times when you're, like, modifying weapons mm -hmm. and armor that their properties might be better than just paint. Like, whatever. Oh my gosh. Oh, so, where is the actual yep, spot? There, there it is. is. These ones are the hardest to get, because they're green. I feel like there was a lot of good puns there, and then that one was just heart mint. Yep. This one is just literally a sunflower, but it's a... Cornflower? I don't know what fruit that's supposed to be. There's some weird ones. Oh god. So fast. Um, so fruit can do more than just, like, feed your pet. Right. You were saying you can feed yeah. it to weapons also. Right. You can use it as, like, a conditioner or whatever. Please, uh, I, sir. Be I believe in you. I believe in you. It was pretty hard to sometimes... I'm gl glad they've not improved that at all. Get them, yeah, originally. Wow, this is bad. Are we just stuck because my bunny's in the way? Probably. I'm I'm under the shadow. No, I see you. Yeah. You're... Oh. Is this one just stuck? Is it just... There it is. Here we go. Yeah. That's a cabadillo. He's cute. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna give him some more. So by the time we come back, hopefully... There'll be more. He also gives you seeds, too. Um, Why? Flat seed. Because is... he can. Okay. Why not? Flat seed is new. Um, does it matter what order seeds you give him, or does your character just simply not understand the difference between the seeds and you just kind of give him whatever? Um, yeah, no, it's mostly RNG, so it doesn't okay. necessarily matter. I think there are like tips for like which seeds to give him mm -hmm. in like quantity, but oh god, I don't remember. <laughs> and again, it's mostly RNG from what I do remember. Um, so it's, it really also depends on the levels of like elements in your land. Sure. We don't really have them built up right now yet. So what you get might be mostly basic stuff that like align with those elements more. And then later when you put more lands around and everything is kind of vibing, then you'll probably get better fruit. And there are better seeds too, to get out in the world. Trenty. Trenty. Yeah. That's his name. Kinda cute nickname. I like how there's just a sword knife thing chilling. I still don't know what <laughs> we're doing yet. Uh, like we're what? exploring and we're making friends in, like who, along the way. Who is th is there a villain in this game? Uh, yeah, we'll we'll okay. find. Uh, there, there is a main quest that is going to unravel kind here. Kind of, sort of, that involves you, okay. yeah, but it also involves a lot of other folks. Um, here, how about we bring one of these kids with us? Who do we want to bring? Uh, bring Bud or Lisa? Give me the dude. Okay, let's grab Bud. Master, I'm Bud, your number one apprentice. Maybe you can only grab the girl. I used to study magic at the academy. There's a little bit of lore. I learned all about the seven wisdoms of Bana. One of them died, so there are only six. Uh-oh. I wonder where they are. Hey, take me on a search for the wisdoms. No. No. Nope. Not yet. I don't want to activate that yet. Thank you for taking us in. 
Do you need to go with me? No, I don't think you can until you do their quest. Why not take oh, me with okay. you? I can't take him yet until we do his quest, but that is going to be way further down because if you activate that now, it kind of sits in the background. But you have to do other stuff to really complete it. So okay. I'll, it's fine. I'll play as the girl. I don't care. Okay. Lisa actually, I think, ah. is stronger than him, in my humble opinion. Um, I always liked having her on my team and building her more than him, but it's just me. I'm ready Personal to party. Preference. Let's do yeah. this. Let's go. She, cool. again, magic user, so it's a little bit different. Just whack stuff with her broom, though. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going back to Domina. Oh, boy. I kind of like that all the Domina quests kind of get out of the way here, though. But we, okay. But we still don't use our new lands yet. <laughs> Not yet. Okay. Um, I think we will after this, though. Okay. Maybe not. No, not yet. Soon. So we're gonna go make some new friends. Um, they're right over here. They also play a jaunty tune. Hey, what's up, yeah? My name's Capella. I'm a wandering juggler. Hey, watch this. All right, cool. This is Diddle. Oh. Oh yeah. I don't know why the music cut there, but oh, he's playing it. He is a music guy. I get it. He's so cute. I love him. What's up, Diddle? Oh. Okay. Where are you going? That's right. This way. That's how he talks. Up. Where are you going? Uh, okay. Hey, where did he go? Um. Oh well. I'll be back. I don't think he will, dude. Nope, okay. I'm not gonna look for him. No siree. <laughs> cool friend. Is that it? Let's go over here. I think something bad is about to happen. We're in the outskirts. Nope, nobody's here. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go okay. back. Back the way we came. Mm -hmm. We have to talk to Capella one more time. Oh, yep. Did you see Diddle? He always goes running off on me. My juggling just won't be the same without his tune. I gotta go look for him! I guess I'll go ask someone. You said you weren't gonna go look for him. Very rude. Okay, we gotta go back. Gotta go back. It's a little bit of back and forth thing. Sure. Oops, oops. See, they let you go in weird areas, too. Where there's nothing, yeah. Yeah. Uh, nothing? Looks like nothing. Okay, we gotta go back to the park, apparently. See, like, you can always, like, go over here. But there's no reason to. You can't go inside. Um, when I was little, I always was just like, oh, well, how do you can open I get door? in there? Right, you can go down here. It's so weird. It's almost like they planned stuff. Yeah, you can't get in there. But, but like, you can't. It's like, why bother even having it be a place Right, you can it's walk? so weird. There's a lot of dead areas like that in this game yeah. that are very strange, which just makes me think the development didn't happen totally all the way. Okay. Doo -doo. Okay, we're near the center of town now. It's not there. Uh, just the sprout. Let's talk to this guy. I saw a bird carry something into the air. I saw a bird. Okay. You want to know about a bird? Just ask a bird. All right, dude. Cool. We're going to the inn. No. Here's a bird. <laughs> oh, I get it. You think I took your friend because some sproutling saw a bird carrying something. Hey, what's up with the bird meat upstairs? <laughs> what was up with the... Okay. Nobody knows. It's ours now. This bird, I think, makes other birds disappear. That's what I think. Her in is a friend? Or is that what you're saying? Yes. Uh oh. Uh, I'm not suspecting you to be the kidnapper, but perhaps this will convince you. I can't fly! Oh yeah. I forgot you were a chicken. Ah. Uh. I'm not a chicken. I'm a canary. Oh. <laughs> are you serious? What do you mean, are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> My bad. My bad, yeah. dude. Come on. Although, I did see Diddle by a stamp a while ago. Perhaps the pelican took your friend. No doubt, there's other birds in town, man. That makes sense. I'll buy a stamp myself and get the pelican's attention. I'll see ya. Seems like a really bad idea. Like... Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> we are going it's a catchy beat. It is. Yeah, a lot of the music is soothing. That confused me. <laughs> I don't see why there has to be loading points in between. It's very old tech. <laughs> yeah. But you kind of just have to do the thing. All right, watch this really good idea happen right now. Okay, I'm I'm ready. <laughs> huh? Boom. All right, later, man. I just realized that that would vibrate if you had Rumble turned on on mm -hmm. your controller. I don't know if Rumble is like back for this or not, or if it's off by default. Like this whole the, part right here. PS5 is... definitely has Rumble. I don't know why there, you're not. Neither of us are. Let's see if we can turn it on. And that is, we're starting Diddle's letter. I don't know what any of these Ring Ring Land. What is I... Ring Ring Land? Save. Oh, it's. it's... Start the ring, 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 ring. Let's listen to the soundtrack. No. Spoilers. Spoilers. Sorry. Why does it keep doing that? Okay. Illustrations. No. Tutorials. Settings. Settings. Vibration off. Why? Off by default. I like it on. There we go. <laughs> Do you want it on as well? Uh, it's it's <gasps> on for everybody. So this this would actually Ooh. let you. Change your keybinds. Here we go. Or go battle controls. I'm trying. There you go. Oh boy. Okay. If you really feel like you gotta change them, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I do. Actually, that can stay as triangle. It's fine. Um, okay. So I don't know what you would change these to because it's kind of the whole all point. you have. Yeah. Yeah. It's not like a keyboard, but at least you can. Yeah, at I least you can. I I think you could in the other version too. Um yeah, everything else seems Oh. So you are always running. That was not something you could change. I would leave it as always running because yeah. there's no reason to walk in this game. So you could toggle running and walking mm. uh, with square. That's why I was trying to press square, and I was like, wait, I'm just running. Like, yeah. Yeah. Um, walking is sometimes nice, so you're not running up to a monster egg all the time. That's just me. Um, but to be honest, like holding square gets fatiguing after a while. I don't even think I can. You, you can't even toggle walk if no. always run is turned yeah, on. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Which is fine. There's no stamina or anything, so it's like, why wouldn't you run? Right. Which, thank god there's no stamina mm -hmm. in this game, because yet another stat to juggle. Yeah, okay. oh. for sure. The letter was a mistake, whoopsity take. Took that letter right away to the Heidi Highway. The Heidi Highway. I love her, she's so cute. Okay, so that's our clue, we gotta go to the highway. Do, oh, do we have the highway? Yeah, the okay. number is the wheel. Where we fought the bandits, but we gave them candy. Okay. Yep. We are this game's getting there. Core progression seems like you should clean the plates that you have in front of you before you open something new. Kinda. Um, yeah. But it gives you a choice. And when I was little, I just remember be like, "Nope, I'm gonna put everything on here. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go there." Like it's super funny mm -hmm. in that way. Again, this is not the only guide. Uh, there are plenty of other guides out there where I think some things are totally different, like from the land choice to sure, I, I, where everything goes. You're making it sound like there's a totally different game if you do that, but... Kind of, yeah, the events are all the same, obviously, but like, I know that there's a guide definitely that just gets you to the monetary as quickly as possible, mm -hmm. which is... Is that, is that like a speed That's run? your end game. Probably, yeah, but I don't know, you know, what... I don't know if it was called the speedrun guide back then, I just remember seeing it on like Game Facts or something. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we're just gonna do this. We're gonna deviate from the path a little bit. Um, eventually. Get, There's get. one gem there. There we go. Cool. I don't think- I don't- I'm not sure if you can turn that off or not. Um, it what? might be hard-coded. The whole, like, review your- What you got, oh, yeah. So you better. probably have to see. Oh, I thought I killed you. Give 
could definitely button through it as fast as possible, though. Also, something I really like is, like, if you ever go to, like, do a hit, mm -hmm. and sometimes the monsters will just jump into your frames. <laughs> like, these rabbits, especially. It's pretty yeah, the, great. The enemies seem like they're kind of going to do what they're going to do, and you can... Like, they don't seem like it they react to you a lot. I don't know. Not really. It some of them feel like they do. Some of them kind of just spit stuff at you, mm -hmm. like, sometimes, and that's their whole MO. Um, what are you doing over there? <laughs> just running in circles, getting hype. <laughs> all right, let's cut some bamboo. I think you're gonna hit all of them. Okay, two for two out of three. Did I get two. I think. Maybe I might have only gotten one. That one's maybe a you hit weird. None of them. I did hit one of them. That one's a weird one. Um, I will say, regrettably, a lot of the sword moves, at least the one-handed sword moves, um, tend to be very narrow. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. What if I do this? Ooh, uh, Halo's cool. Is that an offensive move or a defensive move? Watch. Okay, that seems like a good one. So your magic is up, it said, and um, it definitely dealt damage, like physical damage too. Mm -hmm. So that one's a cool one for her to have as a default. It also knocks them back. Oh, here's a letter. Is this what we're looking for? Yes. Can you get it? Wait, is this guy with us or...? No, he got dropped off here. He's looking. Aha! Looks like Diddle's handwriting. Mm -hmm. How'd you know? We're gonna be a little naughty. Nobody's watching. Go ahead. Watch him. Go ahead. Hey! What did you get here? I don't know, dude. This letter might be my only clue. I need to know what it says. I like that he juggles even just to walk a couple steps. Yeah. Yeah, it's great. Like, some He's of the animations in this game are always perfecting perfect. his technique. Yeah. Dear mother and father, I am doing well here. Okay, so far so normal. What else did he write? I am doing shows with Capella, but it's not going well. Only butterflies and taco bugs watch our shows. Okay. Aww. I'm tired of it, so I'd like to come home. I wonder what Diddle's mom and dad look like. Man! I can't believe this! Uh, okay, uh, let's follow. Okay. These buddies are good to farm. We can't just trade with these bandits. No. We gotta kill them. I don't have a lot of health, that's what I'm noticing. No, we don't, initially. None of us are really high level yet, either. These guys kind of hit hard, too, if you're by yourself. Mm -hmm. Like, um, that's another reason why kind of doing this in order it seems that it prioritizes all the tutorials and stuff. To avoid grinding and stuff, it's just right. here's the quest progression that makes the most sense. Yeah, I wouldn't have known, and I think I went through this solo for like a long time mm -hmm. before realizing, oh shit, I can get a pet, I can get a friend. I'm like, what? Stop running off on your own. Kind of bossy. Come on, let's go back. Here, isn't this your letter? I gotta ask, you didn't put a stamp on your head to get yourself shipped off, did you? Wow, Capella, that really is what happened. <sighs> Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Capella, you didn't open and read my letter, did you? Of course I didn't. I wouldn't do a thing like that. Uh, what really happened? He's so sad. Did we tell him? He did read it, though, right? He read it. Yeah. Oh, his little uh, animation. You're a liar, Capella. Bye. Diddle, I didn't mean to. I mean, you did. Now we're in the caves. Ooh, Would um, we I not have come in here if we told him that he was telling the truth? Uh, no. I think he doesn't believe him. Mm. Or something like that. Ooh, a poison thing. Okay. 
off the top of my head, I don't know what any of this stuff does, honestly. There's it's just also so much of it. I'm sure it's fine. There's just so much of it. Like, there's an abundance of items that really don't, like, you can't use them in game other than to, like, fortify. Nice. I think they're just dead now, right? Okay. Kind of. Or close enough. Woo! Get that guy. Ooh, Ooh we got a bow. The elder bow. Yeah, it suck. <laughs> I'm, like, I remember trying to use a bow in this game. It is tough. Like, I don't think you get to aim, really, but, like, mm -hmm. oh my god. the It's so narrow. Like, the hit. I lost him, and there's a monster over there. What am I supposed to do now? Well, I guess we'll go beat up the monster. We will go fight him. Mm -hmm. That's what we're afraid of. The Gigarex, yeah. Yeah, Grave Dirt. The Digimon. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's a boss. All right. Keep him there. Trying. Yeah, there Got you go. him. That didn't... Okay, there it is. Yeah. Swing it's a little damage. bit of a delay on the bottom. Even bosses will sometimes step into your, like, your thrust or whatever. It's really funny, and then you'll just get the last hit, and it's done. Oh, this guy. We're just beating up on him. Get him. I don't know what Gold Fleet did. What? Did it do uh, something? I think you got interrupted. Maybe? Oh, okay. So when you have magic, you have to hold down. Hold down. Like, there you go. Okay. That's as far as you can go. Now you can let go. I did it. Yeah. So there's like a range that you can set, but usually the bigger you go, the, yeah, the stronger it is. Okay. Nice. I think I got him. Cut his bamboo. Wow. Nice. So when he's targeted, obviously I can't hit him because I don't think the game can handle that. <laughs> Well, makes it's it a weird little because I have just maximum mana full time. Pretty much, yeah. That, okay, that cost my bar, but like the spells were not costing me anything. No, the spells aren't, but you can get interrupted. I think is how they kind of try mm -hmm. and balance that. Um, hmm. We all got something. Okay, we did it. Did not find. We diddle. did not find diddle. Oh. <laughs> Huh? There he is. He's playing a song again. What's up, dude? <laughs> what are you doing in a place like this, Capella? <laughs> what do you mean? I was looking for you. Where were you? Um, I don't know. Oh, yeah. I was looking for you, Capella. Got our wires crossed a bit there. So, is this a side quest, or is this, like, the main quest? This is just another event where you meet people, and you're okay. doing things to help people. Um, <laughs> they do come back, though. <laughs> you're always mad? Look at me. I'm always mad. That's how they keep their superpowers under control. I was looking for you so we can be friends again. Sure, you march to the beat of your own drum. Ha ha. Ha ha. <laughs> not gonna be friends with you again. What? Why not? <laughs> Aggressive juggling. So we're already friends, dummy. Case closed. Come on, let's go. Still bossy though. Wait for me. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Here you go. I just imagine him to have like a pipe organ kind of voice. Got a gator skin. Thanks for the gator skin, dude. We Where did you keep get that. this? We want to keep that forever. He got it somewhere on his travels. We want to keep that. That will come in handy. I do remember that. If you say so. It will. Um, I remember I sold that and mm -hmm. I don't remember if you can get a drop, probably, but it's really hard to get a drop on that. And I had to farm for holidays to get another gator skin for the event that I needed it for. And I was just like, I hate my life. I hate it. All right, cool. We'll be able to uh, do new land placement soon. Oh, goodbye. Try not to have a breakdown without me. Wait. I always like that. 
Oh, okay. So I lose control there. Right. Because okay. you might. Because we're home again. We're home. You might want to pick someone else up. Um, sure. Do, 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 do. We'll talk to him. Welcome home. Okay. Cool. It's so weird that these are missable. That's such a strange choice. It's so. Uh, it's. Yeah. It's just the times, I guess. Yeah, whatever. Um, I don't remember if the next one is actually... I don't think there's a lot of combat in the next one, so I'm not going to take you with me. That's fine. Unless you want to come. No, I yeah. yeah. You can give uh, what's-her-name the day off. Lisa. <laughs> we'll go check on our fruit farm. I'm going to call it that fruit farm. I don't think it's ready yet, because you only went back and forth like one time. We'll see. I've completely lied to you. See some of those tiny ones? You can't get them yet. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah. so some of them are ready. Some of them are ready. And it's kind of tempting to like just give him more seeds. Mm -hmm. But we're not going to do that, because then everything... I think it just confuses the game. At least that's how I've always felt about it. Right. Like, they give you the choice to do it, but... There's just so many just... different kinds of fruit, too. Oh, uh, yeah. There's like 40 different kinds or something like yeah, that. Like yeah. Like, a substantial amount. Mm -hmm. Come on. Come on, mm -hmm. give me, give me this tiny carrot. Down near the bottom here, it seems like you really have to mean it. Yeah, it was always kind of difficult. Let's see if he gives us any seeds, sir. You have a seed for me. Ooh, cool, cool. Round, round seeds seed. Are cool. I think that one's new. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. More round seed. Thanks. All right, uh, let's go do this next quest. Is kind of a main. I guess you could call it a main quest, like <laughs> whatever that whatever that means in the context of Legend of Mana. I guess. Yeah, it's a very intertwined que mm -hmm. quest, though, like with these characters. All right, watch. I'm gonna discover now if I messed this up. I did not. How Ooh. do you know that you didn't mess it up? Because there was that space to the left of the highway mm -hmm. and I was like oh no if I put my house one space too much to the left then everything is messed up because now I can't go any more left here uh huh so this is where it's supposed to be though okay let's go to the Gato Grottos Gato Grottos really a uh, weird place mm -hmm. cool okay so this is another town then Kind of, yeah. It's like a town in the cliffs, hills, mm -hmm. I guess you could say. Uh, These guys are cool. They're nuns. Sure. Yeah. These are the grottos. They're well known for the Temple of Healing. Okay. Uh, there's a shop here. You can go in this shop, I think. Or maybe it's yet. up there. Or mm -hmm. Oh, it's the big door. Big door. Flame of Hope. Well, that just instantly started that quest. Yes. Uh, excuse me, are you feeling alright? My tummy hurts. Could you help me with the six sproutling? Uh, thanks. Oh, my tummy. Feel that, dude. Uh, we're gonna go walk to that shop over there. <laughs> Ooh, I can't. Someone help me! And then he runs away. He seemed fine now. All right. I wonder if it will be all right. Maybe the mountain pass wore that sprouting out. And he just had a little, little nap in the middle of nowhere. Okay, I want to go there. Hello, student. More minerals? Hmm. Okay, so we still can't buy anything because we have no money. I wouldn't even know what to buy right. yet. Yeah. I kind of do, but it's like, I just don't have any money. It's pray to the spirits of wind and fire. People of the world may live in peace. Okay, it's admirable. Can I get past you? Can I go in here? No. Nope, it's just that one down there, but I can't get past her yet. Um, okay. We're gonna kind of figure some stuff out. Okay, the Sproutling went here. This guy's cool. Yeah, we're gonna talk to this guy. Um, this is Rubens. What up, Rubens? Mm -hmm. He's a firekeeper. Uh, he wants to ask us something. Here, thief is after the temple's flame. Oh boy. Do you see anyone suspicious on your way here? There was a Sproutling. That's... There was a Sproutling. A Sproutling? Oh, that guy. I doubt it's involved. 
Guess the thief was just a rumor. The inspector exaggerates everything. Okay, anything else? Do you want me to ask you? About you. My job is to keep the torches burning at the temple. The temple is up the path to the left. Do you think you got the hairstyle before the job or the other way around? Uh, probably a little bit of both. Okay. <laughs> it Just... is pretty flamey. Like, it's whoosh, mm -hmm. looks like fire on his head. About the sprawling. It's acting strange. I think it went to the terrace. Okay. Let's ask about the inspector. He's a mouse man with a pipe and a booming voice, which He's is a, a mouse literal man. description of him. Keeps pestering me to be careful all the time. Just watching out for you, dude. Alright, we're gonna go to the right. Follow the Spratling. There's something going on up here. Yeah, okay, what's up? My tummy hurts. Please help me. Let me see. Oh, it's a popo bug. <laughs> One of, of those can is. cure most anything. Help me! I go so far as to say it's a cure all. Mm. Sounds expensive. Better get it off you. You're gonna help me? Just have to pull off a leaf to remove the bug, you won't feel a thing. No, don't do that. What a waste. Popo bugs are so expensive. So he's feeling sick, but he has a bug on him that cures everything? Is Maybe that... not his sickness. Okay. Maybe the bug is bad for him because he's literally made of leaves? I mean, sure. <laughs> okay, so why would Ruben swamp the bug? Wait, what else do you know? He likes to come up here. He must love the breeze. Okay. Oh, great. I mean, I, I'm sure it's a great breeze. I feel like you would get blown off that cliff like so easily. <laughs> okay. Do, do, do. Nope. Let's see what's up. <gasps> yeah. A note. Uh-oh. You might be in trouble. Is Rubens a party member? No. Really? I thought yeah. that was the easiest yes of all time. I know. It would be super cool. Uh, if he was. Unfortunately, no. You just had to go look at it? Yeah. Okay. To establish. Okay, so he's gone. I think we're gonna go back up here. Maybe, Maybe not. Hello? Hello? Kinda get stuck on the land sometimes. <laughs> no, not yeah. this way yet. Maybe we have to go back to town. If not, we're going inside that temple. Let's go in the shop really quick, go over here. At least we can oh, go Oh, that there. door just opens, yeah. That door opens. Oh, hello. Who's this person? Hmm. This person's looking hmm. at jewels. Excuse me, are you looking for gems? Uh, yes? I wouldn't buy any of these. Gems with no sparkle are as good as useless. Very discerning person. Shopkeeper person. What do they have? Okay, so now we're getting into iron. Wait, is that different from what you have? Yep. So down there you can see. It's just better, mm -hmm. yeah. So... Gosh, I want my spear so bad. Can you not start with a spear? I can buy the spear right now and change it out if sure. I want to. Yeah, why wouldn't you? Yeah. I think the sword in this... Oops. It's just... Why are we stuck here? Okay, let's go outside. <laughs> um, The sword is just more well-rounded mm -hmm. um, to get you your stats. Let's... Cool. Unusable STs removed. So you, you gotta redo your skills now. Right. I don't know what off gotcha. means. Never know. That's okay. Um, I kind of like the so spears better. So you have to relearn really the techniques anyway? Yeah, yeah cool. that's fine. Hey, whatever. It's fine. It doesn't take too long to mm -hmm. learn like the first couple. And I like them better anyway. It's just much more fun to play the mm -hmm. spear, in my opinion. Okay, we're gonna go to this ominous kind of temple place. It's supposed to be a temple of healing, but it's really spiky. Okay, uh, he's freaking out. Hey, dude. Oh, 
Maybe. Later. Again. Nope. Oh boy. Stop that. Me. This is Choco. <laughs> <laughs> My tummy hurts. Please do something about the popo bug. I mean... Isn't she trying to take it off him? I think this is a different nun. Hmm. Calm your soul and all your worldly pains will vanish. Yeah. <laughs> if only it were that simple. But it hurts! Then meditate. The mind controls everything. I don't think that's... Sure. <laughs> Somebody help me! Right, later, he's, again. He's so upset. <laughs> Please do not interrupt me. I am praying. I'm sorry. Uh, can I go here? Uh, here's a room. Oh, hello, everybody. There's a different guy. To live is to live. The Sproutlings are so weird. They're like this subhuman species mm -hmm. that just sort of... Like, they seem to vary in how smart they are. Like, they're not really consistent. Yeah. Like, they're not quite Moogles, but they're definitely not, like, full-fledged other people. Right. I agree. We are all here to attain enlightenment, apparently. Uh, there's Dana again. We're gonna ignore her for now. What's in here? Ooh, another box. Uh, this is where they all live, apparently. Excuse me while we steal your while stuff. While we steal your shit, yeah. That's great. Aroma oil. All the senior nuns say the same thing to us. Trainees were back, better back in our day. Rude? Sounds... Oops. <laughs> Sounds kind of, uh, ageist. What is an abbess? I think that's, like, your head nun. Okay. Oh, I wasn't aware that I was a confessional for you. Okay, we're gonna Abbas is a cool word that if it actually means that, I'm surprised you don't see it used more. Right. I'm not actually sure if that's like an official word or maybe it's just an archaic word that we don't use anymore. Um, I'm gonna go back to the fork. Uh, 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 uh. Go right. Did he go back up here? <laughs> Ah, here we go. There we go. Drama. It's definitely like a walk and talk ish. Oh, please don't tear off my leaves. Alright, my dear, come over here. I will help you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Little naive sproutling. Okay, they're looking at him. Ugh. Sounds like they tore off his leaf. And now he's just dead. What's the matter? Don't you want to revive your petrified sweetheart? Plot point. Of course I do. Yeah. Wouldn't you? But we really don't play as this guy. He seems like no, you don't, a major party member with us, like a motivation and everything. Right. Um. Okay. Yeah. Don't worry. We'll get to play as someone somewhat similar. Okay. Oh, sure. you big meanie. Okay, bye. I mean, they literally- okay, they literally ripped off his skin. Like, I'd be so mad. It grows back. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Look, it got away! I don't want to hurt anyone. How noble. You can't protect anyone, you're too soft. I don't think a nun should be, like, talking like this. Nuns can be stern. I guess. Life is like this town. You have to cut through the rocks to make a path. I guess so. Just gonna shoulder check me on the way out. <sighs> Ugh. <laughs> the path will never reach the mountaintop if the flame of hope in our hearts goes out. Oh, she said the title of the event. Don't you think so? I don't know, lady. I'm just a bystander in all of this. Sir? Nothing? You got nothing. Nothing. That's it. We have done what we have come here to do, I guess. Only those who are strong enough can survive. It's nature's way. Sure. Alright, well, let's leave. Going back to the temple, maybe? Maybe? Uh-oh. Oh, she's not- oh, she's just down. Okay. Yep. Aha! The inspector has arrived. This guy is cool, can I play as him? No. <laughs> a crime has been committed! The victim is a nun. No external wounds. Ew, don't touch the body. 
I'm not trying to touch her body, dude. <laughs> I'm still alive. My apologies, are you alright? Twisted my ankle when the Sproutling bumped into me. That darn Sproutling just keeps getting in the way. So she disguised herself as a Sproutling. What is she up to? Who's she? I love this animation, it's so funny. Blast it, Sandra. Who's Sandra? Are you sure you're okay? Do you want me to like call somebody? And we're just gonna leave her there. Bye. All right. <laughs> She's fine, I guess. She's fine. She can take care of herself. She's in the Temple of Healing. Okay, um, anything else wild happening over here? We sure do get a workout running back and forth. Mm -hmm. Oh. What is it? I think I'll get the Popo Bug from that Sproutling. Go ahead. I'm not doing it. Oh, Callus, You don't care one way or another about your girlfriend and Geo. Do you know where she is? Uh-oh. Good question. Stop playing games. Her playing a game. Uh, can I take the bug? Fine by me. You don't care if the Sproutling dies or your girlfriend sleeps forever, do you? I don't want to interfere in anyone's life. I don't want anyone interfering in mine. Just leave me alone. Never. Alright, it's kind of creepy. Uh-oh. Okay. Jewels that lose their sparkle must be dealt with. Okay. Ow. And she's ripped his heart out, basically. Okay. What have you done? Are the monks evil? No. They're not, actually. But they seem evil. You'll see. Come any closer and I'll kill him. Do as I say and I won't harm your core. Basically, his heart. What do you want? <laughs> I want to see some tears. <laughs> I want you to cry like a baby and beg for your life. Well, where are your tears? But I can't. It's just too bad. Goodbye, Ruby Knight. Oh boy, she's gonna... She just killed him? Pretty much, yeah. What? But the knights... The, nu the knights... The nuns aren't bad? You'll see. Jimmy of the Lucidia are a tough bunch indeed. The Jimmy are important. I'll be taking the Flame of Hope now. So... He is the Flame of Hope. <laughs> I okay. won't be caught so easily. See you around. Bye! No! <laughs> he just gets pissed. <laughs> Too late. He's gonna get mad. Yeah, I know. He pops like popcorn. I love it. Blast it. So it was you all along. Oh, great. Cave yourself up, Sandra, and take those stupid sticks out of your hair. Hey, dude. Not cool. Sandra? <laughs> He's looking for someone named Sandra. No, not her. It was a nun. <laughs> Sandra is a master of disguise, but I will catch her. Oh, later. Hey, are you... Uh... Oh, Diana is his girlfriend. Lover, whatever. Girlfriend seems like such a weirdly like modern word for this like, situation. Yeah, for this like this whole dynamic. world that we're in here. Thy yeah. maiden. Okay, it's a little archaic for this, but I went too far. Yeah, too you far went back. Back too far. It's okay. Uh, he wishes he could see Diana again. I'm sorry. Bye. Oh okay. no. He is just He's dead. He's just dead. All right. That lady killed him for his core. Oh, that's so sad. So there's some nefariousness at foot in this world. The temple received a note from Sandra, the jewel hunter, and said that she was going to steal the flame of hope. Thought she meant the sacred torches. We all did. She was after Reuben's core. Only I'd known Reuben's was a Jimmy. I mean, did he hide the core? That's the thing. Like, maybe he was just hiding it. Like, mm -hmm. and so that's how nobody could tell because it's right. like right here in their body. Like, it's pretty obvious. 
Need your help. Will you cooperate? What? Nope is the first. <laughs> it, like, why Why say no? Like, because what? this game has a weird sense of humor. Would it? But I, I'm scared that it would just end the quest for you. It might. I have never said no. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I would say no. I'm not that kind of adventurer. Something tells me that she's still nearby. I'll search the temple in the village. You go check the surrounding area. Let's go. Oh, okay. Let's go, rabbit. Back the way we came again. Uh, yep. We're going a little bit further this time, though. Okay, this area you can accidentally leave. <laughs> Just step the wrong way. Uh, that's a bleed. Okay. It's playing the battle music, but I, are we just not? Uh, sometimes it just... It just does that? Yeah. So okay. Follow the leaves. Okay, we do have to fight a little bit. You got this. Hello, little guys. What are those guys? Wow, the spear seems really good. Yeah, the okay. spear rocks, dude. The spear is the move. Yep. We've got range. Stabby stab with it. It's pretty good. Got a rock. Cool. Hey, follow the leaves. Oh, yeah, there's so many monsters in this game, like monster types, they're mm -hmm. pretty cool. And almost all of them you can hatch from an egg and get yourself. Okay, so. God, there's a part I remember with the leaves that if you... They just put a leaf somewhere stupid and it's hard to see. I think it's right there. Those look like Pokemon. Like their eyes. Kinda, yeah. It looks like Arbok. Yeah. Ah, and then they do this thing where they grab you. Oh, I don't have any STs yet. Chocolate! I can see why the guide has you get the, like, the beast. Yeah. Just having something else for the enemies to attack makes such a big difference. Right. I agree. Um, you can get stuck in that little grabby attack that it does and just die. That's happened to me before. Mm -hmm. Just running through the game. I'm like, uh, okay. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so that's there. There's a big tree dude over here. Oh, there's oh. birds. Okay, I think I'm supposed to Those go. Those also look like Pokemon. Kinda? Yeah. Ow. <laughs> ah! Ah! Sweet. Got a needle. Let's just fight this guy. Cause sure, yeah. why not? You can also get him as a pet. And I think I had one. And I really liked him, but they're very slow. Ow. Ow. Okay, let's go back this way. Okay. I got scared. Oh. Hey. Okay. I guess we have to go back the other way. What's up, ladies? What you doing in here? Just hanging out with these barrels of stuff. <laughs> Guarding them. Can I sell your stuff later? Can you just hit the barrels? No. You can't, you, okay, so, so you those... can attack when not in combat. Right? right. Also, sorry, we're gonna reload a bit here. Just because um, monsters do respawn. Uh, yeah, clearly. Yep. This is definitely so a farm you, game. <laughs> the, the whole the turning off encounters that's new to this remake right yeah oh, okay totally like keep pressing the wrong did we get something there i did huh oh mighty javelin okay Ooh. okay cool yeah. that's l1 i have to remember that i'm really bad at remembering where my stuff is i have wondered what the difference between a javelin and a spear is. Mm -hmm. There is definitely a difference between them, but mm -hmm. sometimes it's used interchangeably like that. Right. And it's like, are javelin... I always thought javelins... I guess that's a short spear. Like, they have a, a sh super short... Right. Like, wood part. That's just a short spear. Mm -hmm. Like, a javelin is just a light spear, right? Maybe, perhaps. I don't know. 
You obviously throw a javelin, but yeah. you don't throw a spear. Well, you could throw a spear, though. You could, but, but I think is it like a situation where, like, the second you throw a spear, it becomes a, a javelin? javelin. Well, isn't a javelin like? <laughs> no, because like I, I know what you're saying like there's like the short spear, or, like the sh the shield yeah. and the the spear. I think that's just a short spear. I have no idea. I'm not a weapons expert. A spear expert. Mm -hmm. Alright. So this Sprawling is very trusting, or just has a really short memory. Okay, that, that looks is like this our monk person. evil? It's like she's hiding amongst the other I think er, so. nuns, excuse me. She's um in disguise. Right. As as it would be. Yep. Oh boy. It was her the entire time. She has flowers in her ears. Yeah. Her ears are flowers? I think she's really pretty. Ha, ha. She kind of looks like a fighting game character. She used the Cancun bird. I don't know why it's named the Cancun bird. Ow, ow, ow. Oh. We're back to normal. <laughs> I wish we could see the bird. He's really cool looking. Uh oh. Is he playing dead? <laughs> So, he also just said another genie was murdered, so... So the Sproutlings can also have the gems? No, 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 no. Okay, they're just I think she was trying to okay. get the bug from him. Okay. And then she also took the core from Rubens. I Apparently got it. the genie are being targeted. Um, now we're gonna get something. Ooh, okay, we got a new land. Artifact. Two new lands. Two of them. Thanks. I will catch you, Sandra. Mark my words. It is such a weird concept that this place and all people in it didn't exist until you willed it into existence. Kind of is kind of the weird thing that the Sproutling was saying to you yeah, at the beginning. Yeah, the Sproutling like, was literally saying exactly yeah. that. It's just such a weird concept. Right. Which really puts the game into the player's hands as opposed to like, here's this big linear story, here's mm -hmm. this person who's already has a name and a backstory, like kind of creating whatever that. I guess. It doesn't go that deep, obviously, but you do get to help people, and they seem to appreciate it most of the time. For sure. Did you have a stop point in mind for this first episode? Is there a specific spot in the story you're trying to hit? Are we trying to hit a time? No, I think that was actually a really good spot to stop. Okay. Um, just trying to harvest my fruits. Um, Got a pair of heels. Sure. And so th this game, I think, is, I think we said at the top, somewhere around 25 hours. Uh, uh yeah. I feel like ideally. you're moving at a brisker pace than that, maybe. Just I might be, yeah. Maybe, and which is fine. I mean, hey, that's still plenty long. Yeah. Um, Lens to the guide. Um, I think in general, just because you can move fast like this all the time, it helps a yeah, lot, and you're right. not just wandering around everywhere. I feel like we made good progress on the game and no progress on the story, if that right. makes sense. <laughs> I don't think we will make progress on the main story for a little bit, but right. it's coming up. Okay, I um, trust you on that. I mean, you gotta set the stage. This is back when JRPGs took their time getting the story going. True, and again, this has more little threads instead of one. Mm -hmm. Like, it has one big cohesive thread, but it's gonna take a little... A bunch of little threads to kind of get there along yeah, the way. Yeah, for sure. All right, so he wrote his diary. So we want to save there. Save. Yep. Watch, I can make us bigger, I think. Can I make us bigger? <laughs> We're a little bigger. Yay. Um, yeah, so that was uh, part one. Uh, maybe they'll all be roughly what, what a, two and a half hours exactly on your playtime? That makes sense. I think so. Yeah. Right? Yes? Yeah. Something like that's, that. That's not too bad. But anyway. Join us next time as we uncover what this game is actually about. I I don't know. Lots more adventures. I had a good um, time. Yeah. We're, I'm, we're again, established, so. Still not sure what we're doing, but I'm sure it will be made clear. It will. In due time. I promise. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you liked the beginning of this playthrough and want to see more, please, you know, leave a like. Hit a notification bell button. All that good stuff. Yeah. And we'll see you next time. Thanks. Thanks.